It's time to kick ass and chew bubble gum. And I'm all out of gum. All right, so now let's see. Nope. Ha, I should have known better. All right, so the audio at least is working. Even if I am peaking a little high. Give me a moment here. Clearly the Elgato thing. Oh yeah, okay. This is a this is a this is a streamer fail on my part. Luckily, I know how to fix that. So we just move from one error screen to the other as I get the right thing to fail and retry. <laughs> <laughs> I son of a bitch. There it goes. It made it. It made it dark in here. I should have turned the overhead lights on. I should have turned the overhead lights on. I guess that's my own fault. Give me a sec. I'll be right back. Oh, look at that. Look at that. That's much better. That's much better. How's it going, everybody? Happy Monday. Happy Monday. There we go. All right. Excellent. It seems like... Of course. It does it needs the old Indian... <laughs> you know, Abyss, I should get me one of those. That would make a great overlay, wouldn't it? Just push the button. That'd be a great BRB, wouldn't it? No, Bourbon Bottling Team. See if I can get it to show up. Can you hopefully? There you go. There you go. That's my bourbon bottling team shirt from last year. So what they used to do, and I have them for 21, 22, and 23. When you go and you volunteer at Garrison to do a bottling uh, gig, you get a t-shirt, you get um, a boot flask, and usually you used to get some other loot. They've kind of they're in the middle of changing it up. The t-shirts used to be done by year, such that the 21 one I have is black. The 22 ones I have are gray. This one is white for 23. But this year, um, I know, right, Grant? But this year they've gone away from the, the, they apparently didn't like the fact that they had to print them with years on them because then you can't give them away early and you can't, like, you'd only give them away in that year. So it makes it very difficult, right? So... They've now gone to a more generic shirt design that no longer has the year on it, which I find very sad. But I understand. Uh, it just says, you know, uh, Texas Garrison, you know, bourbon bottling team. I came, I saw, I quality controlled, whatever, right? Because that's the thing. When you work all day, about every 45-ish minutes, you get a communion cup of bourbon, a quality control shot. <laughs> All right, so restream is wor the restream bot is working. That's good. I think, fingers crossed, he won't repeat things um, in the chat window once we get into game. So we'll see. Yeah, Grant, I'm going to be curious, right? It's going to be the Duke's voice without being called Duke. So, And he won't be like, the Duke I have is very vulgar. He'll be like family-friendly Duke, right? When you talked to uh, in Rotterdam, no, afraid not white. <laughs> afraid not. Not in Rotterdam. Um, I am planning on going to TwitchCon in the U.S., which is in San Diego in the back back half of September. Um, the um, when you talk to, I, I had a, a fun conversation with um, um, was it Legionnaire? I think it was Legionnaire that did a lot of the work. When you, if you guys watch the Carrier Con stream about where they had John St. John on the ship, they talked to him about you know, uh, Legionnaire writing the lines and everything. And um, so I talked to him afterwards and I was like, I was like, dude, I'm soaked for this. And he goes, you have no idea how long I've been sitting on this. I've been excited. I've been ready. I've been waiting. And I said, um, hang on a minute. Let me, why did this, just a moment. Um, but I told, I told a legionnaire, I said, you know, half the fun of Duke is, is the vulgarity, right? I said, yes, it's not family friendly, but you never know what's going to come out of his mouth. Right. And that's half the fun of it. And he goes, yeah, obviously we couldn't push our, our game up to like an R, you know, a, a, an M rating. 
he goes, but I walked right up to that line. <laughs> he goes, he goes, I actually, the first time I sat down and wrote up lines, you know, uh, uh, recording lines for, for John to do for the voice. He goes, I took him to my boss and said, I want you to double check me on this and make sure I'm not going too far. <laughs> and I was like, okay, I like what I'm hearing. So I'm excited for this. This is going to be good stuff. I'm, I'm ready for that voice. Um, tonight, guys, of course, we're back to Civ, right? It's been a couple of weeks. Um, we uh, we weren't able to play last week. Sith was not feeling well. She's already in chat tonight, so that's a good sign. I think I think we should be good. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and hop over to the correct screen here, which I believe is this one. Yep. Except now I've got to make some uh, some camera adjustments here. Give me a moment. I've got to do that, and then we've got to do a little of this. And got to make. I've got to embiggen myself there. There we go. All right, that should fix it. Now that I've gone back to using. Elgato's stuff. Adeljel, thank you for the resub. 42 months. Oh, I'm getting old. I'm getting old. Thank you so much. Appreciate you. All right, let me unmute this thing. Are we there yet? Are we doing this or what? Kitten has had an issue with her PC. She's doing a integrity check. Okay. Well, that sucks, but I understand. I just went over and checked her computer. She hit the head, but she's in the 90% for verification, so it should be just a few more moments. Yeah, we figured next it's exactly right, is Grant. Uh, restarting the PC if, it, if it's still not working. But basically, she says to she goes to run the game. It looks like it's going to run, and then it just fails out. So I'll, I'll spoil one for you. I'll spoil one for you that, that Legionnaire gave me. Um, it was, you know, but okay. how are you, Raptor? I'm good. My chat, my chat was asking me about the uh, the Duke Nukem voice, so I'm I'm sharing with them. I was about to share with them a spoiler that Legionnaire gave me. He was basically saying um, that, of course, because of Warships' rating, when they wrote he wrote the lines, he can't include vulgarity. And I, and I, I, I was like, I, I told him, I said, I found that sad. I said because the vul the vulgarity out of Duke's mouth is some of the fun of it. You never know what's going to come out of his mouth. Absolutely, that is part of the fun. Exactly. And he said, I know. He goes, but I can't, he goes, I can't unilaterally raise the, the rating on our game to M because I feel like it. I was like, oh, that's fair. All right, I get it. He goes, but, he goes, I walked right up to that line. And I said, I'm sure oh. he did. He goes, he goes, the first time I wrote the lines out, I took them to my boss, which was um, Evan, right? He goes, I took the lines to Evan and said, hey, double check me and make sure I haven't gone too far with these. And I said, really? He goes, let me give you an example. He goes, you know how when you, you, you get to max depth in a submarine, if you tell the submarine to dive deeper, the sub commander will tell you, oh, you know, I can't, get unable to perform command or something, right? It's like, yeah, yeah. He goes, well, what Duke says is, this is as deep as I go. And I was like, okay, that's pretty good. <laughs> well, you know, yeah, that works. <laughs> Yeah, I don't. I don't know, Craven. We've been working on some of that. Man, my mic. But yeah, is you got to keep that rating. Crazy, I think the rating is a bigger deal over in Europe, frankly, than it is in North America. It's it's absolutely a big deal. Turn. I'm gonna turn my own microphone down a hair, so I'm not blowing y'all's eardrums out because it feels. I keep looking over and seeing myself peek like crazy. No, it's not vulgar, Wayne. But that's the point. It's not vulgar, but it's very suggestive. Let's say. I have news. She is loading in. Excellent. Yay. Yeah, it's Chinko. That'd be a good one, right? If I go any deeper, somebody else might feel it. You know, like, you could you could have all kinds of fun with it. Um, so I'm really looking forward to, to hearing to hearing the Duke, the Duke, the official Duke captain in the game. He will not be called Duke Nukem. They can't do that. That's a licensed name belonging to someone else. But they can steal the voice, right, and call him something else. So that's what that's the plan. Oh, Abyss. I would love it if Greer would do I wouldn't wouldn't J, James Earl Jones doing Greer's voice, man. I would pay real money for that. I would pay real money for that. That would be a good one. That's one of my favorite parts he's ever been cast in. I loved him as I loved him as Greer. Greer yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Can't you can't, I mean Let's be honest, he doesn't have a lot of lines in Red October. But there's a few that you could clip out that might be kind of fun, you know? Torpedoes detected could be mother of God, you know, and all that kind of stuff. <laughs> it's battleship sighted, 
big son of a bitch. You know, like, <laughs> you could have a little bit of fun with it. In fact, you could probably make just a Red October sound pack, right, for warships. Just with the, you clip things, you just clip the, it would be everybody. It would be Greer and Ryan and, and Mancuso and Ramius, and you could mash it all up. It would actually be a lot of, it would be a lot of fun. Did he really, Ching? I didn't know that. That's really cool. So Wayne, um, you ask about you ask, are we getting the captain soon? The answer is I don't know. I believe I would have to go back and watch the stream if they said when. I think it was summer. I feel like they were talking about it was going to come with one of the summer patches. So a few months, right? It's it's what it's the end of March. April's next week, basically. April's next week. So yeah, I mean you're a few months out still at least. But they obviously wanted to 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 get the the word out and drum up a little bit of hype, and I'm pretty hyped. I think that's going to be fun, man. I am going to be so lost when we zone into this game. We started so many different games last time. I don't, even, I don't even remember which one stuck. On the bright side, I'm pretty sure most of us, if not all, are in that same position. <laughs> <laughs> pretty much. There has been updates on Hearts of Iron 4 since then. Do you think I remember even what nation I'm playing? Yeah, I know, right? I'm glad you're it's... feeling better, Kitten, by the way. Thank you. Yeah, I still have a little bit of food poisoning, but it's Oof. nothing compared to... Food poisoning is the worst. Isn't it? Now, that would be fun, Grant. That is Gerd Bourbon, but it is not Garrison. It is not nearly hot enough to be Garrison. Hmm. Donis is coming. Donis is coming to town this week. Santa Donis is coming to town. Nice abyss. Ching, I saw somebody had done a recut of his big scene in Rogue One. Right? There's that big scene uh, on Mustafar. He and Krennic have a conversation. Oh, you know, careful, you know, careful director, don't choke on your ambitions. And, um, but when you listen to Vader's voice in that scene, you can very clearly tell it's older James Earl Jones, right? As compared to 1977 James Earl Jones. And what this guy had done was he remixed the audio to try to de age Jones's voice. And I thought it came out pretty well. It wasn't flawless, but it was pretty good. And I was like, see, that sounds more like the Vader you see at the start of A New Hope, right? And I was like, that would be pretty awesome. Maybe Abyss, I... From the first stir I'll say this, I still feel like Obi-Wan was was not a great series overall. It had a lot of, flaw, a lot of flaws. I really did enjoy seeing Hayden come back to the part, and I really did like the energy he brought with it. I vaguely remember this game. Okay, yes, I'm remembering now. I'm glad you do. Yeah. This is the one where... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I know where I'm at. Friggin' um, Vices is off to my west. Zath is somewhere off to my east. Other way around. But yeah. Okay, I remember this game now. We didn't get very far. <laughs> Right, yeah, I was going to build one final uh, city up here. Right, and then I was going to set... You. I, right, I was going to settle one somewhere along the Odor, and that was going to be our little border there. Right. Right, right, I remember that. And then Vices and I are kind of fighting for for land and territory in between us, trying to figure all that out. Okay. Yeah, so what I need to do... this This city is so strong, I have to settle this ASAP. Right, like literally ASAP. In fact, I also need to mark down a encampment. I should mark an encampment there, and I should mark an encampment here. <clears throat> yeah. 
and I'm pushing a settler. I'm, I'm kind of going on a full scale settler binge right now. Um, I've got a settler here, and then I'm gonna. I'm probably gonna go into. Damn it! I need astrology. Okay. I'm gonna. I'm gonna get bronze working next turn. Then I'm gonna. Okay. So what I'm gonna need to do then is we're gonna need to follow up. I'm gonna do it on cash. I've got a little bit of cash. I need to get a religion started. Blessedly, I don't think anybody else is there. No. I've got a spot to build Stonehenge, which for Ludwig is really welcome attractive. To Jurassic Park. Tink, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. Yeah, there's a lot going on in this game, Tink. I hear you. The tutorial is, it's been a long time since I played it, but memory serves, it's actually quite solid. Um, Man, I'm, oof, I want to take this guy south, but I'm afraid if I sleep on this, I'm going to lose it. So I think I really got to take this next settler, this guy, I got to take him north as qu as quickly as possible. It looks like that's about a nine turn walk. Zath, I'm going to try and back those um, slingers out of your way. If you'd let them get okay. out before you build your city and set the border up, I would appreciate it. Yeah, no problem. Okay. Uh, you should be able to get this. So I need to move two from my where my settler is. I'm moving two to the right, and that's where I'm going to build the city there. Okay, that will probably work because I think if I if I I think I'll be just like one hex ahead of you, and then when you build, it'll like throw me away from you or something. So I think I'll be okay. Yeah, yeah, it'll shove you if anything closer to your territory. That's so what I'm hoping. Fine. Right, right, right. And if it doesn't work, we can always open borders it. True. I just know people get nervous when you ask, so I was just trying to, you know, avoid it. Oh. I mean, I don't care, but, you know, some people get nervous when you ask for open borders. I don't know why. They just do. All right. We found Kilimanjaro. We love that. Astrology. We're for... Okay. All right, Madge, let's do a water mill and a, into a builder. I'm going to need to mine some stuff here. I probably need... I'm going to let this tile pick up naturally, and then I'm going to start buying land out in this direction. I need to... He's got a city, like, right here. I need to try and choke him out of continuing to grow this way. If he gets this spot, it's probably good enough it's worth going to war over. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> I don't. I don't want to. An early war would really slow me down. But if the terrain is right, it's probably worth it. Now, one, two, th let's see, one, two, three. So my the the city for this probably needs to go. Sass said he was going to build here. One, two, three. So this is as close as I can build to him. Um, and I probably don't even want to build that close. I probably want to build right here. One, two, three. Yeah. Here, one of these two hexes is probably pretty good for what I want to do. And then I can put an encampment, like, right here, maybe, or something. Um, right? Maybe do something like... Let's just, let's just play around for a minute. Um... Is that too close? One, two, that's too close. So that's not legal. So I'm going to have to do probably that. Okay, so if I do that, then we want to do, I want to do a dam. Well, Vices, it seems I have circled the globe and found you on the other side. Oh, right, I can't do a dam there. Oh, stupid piece of stupid crap game. Which is weird, because I haven't found Kitten yet. Choose research. We need astrology. Lickety split, please. Get good. I don't know what to tell you. Have I found you? Yes. Oh, okay. I was going to chop this because eventually that's going to become a holy site. I think I found one of your units. I don't think I found the actual, like, your sieve. Okay. Um... Uh... 
Uh, go down here and have a look, I guess. Uh, let's well, go. okay. We've got a warrior all um, by himself. All right, so let's plan this out. I need me. Yeah. If I do. Yeah. Don't worry about it. Damn. I mean. I gotta gotta worry. He's just exploring. This should yes, still be a legal damn like spot. Like an STD, like, uh, uh, no. All right, like, let's Genghis try here. Will you let me do this one? No, you're still being a jerk. I'm I playing Rome. There's no reason that this is not a legal damn. I'm just saying the way you spread in game. And then if I do something like that, no, I need to do I need to do this and this. That is solid. If not, it's maybe not flawless. And then probably look at something like this. Oh, hey, I okay. see a settler. This is something I still want to work on because if I can build Panama Canal and a canal, I can still cut through here. I may end up conquering this city state yet. We'll see. What is his you bonus do, again? And you also see my warrior right behind you too, right? He's actually really good for no, me. I, I kind of don't want to conquer him. Damn it. Yeah, there's a the warrior behind you too. All right. Behind now, where me. did I find oh. iron? Okay. I've got an iron source right here. I love that. Iron doesn't like right now. I don't have any iron disrupting any of my building plans. I've got two quick, easy sources of iron nearby and they don't interrupt anything. There's a source here. Excellent. Excellent. Choose Civic. Defense, Games and Rec. Games and Rec is probably a better start for me. Let's do Games and Rec. All right, we're in Frankfurt. Um, I'm one turn off of Astrology. Let's... I don't need the Granary right now. Um, I need to wait for the Holy Site. Let's put in... Go ahead and put in one turn of Watermill... And then next turn, I'll swap to the holy site, like lickety split. Hey, I get a governor. All right. Um, <coughs> that does not help me. That sort of helps me. That's really awesome. Dubious, dubious. It's going to be you. I just need to figure out where to put you. I think I put you in Frankfurt for now. Because you're going to have probably my first district by the time I'm done. So let's do that. A little bit of culture boost never hurt anybody. Sure. Sure. Sath has All a right, giant Raptor, enormous well, uh, military Are you score. okay if I settle now? Yeah, I think it's going to push me either to the south or to the east, and that's fine. That's good enough. I just wanted to get around the mountain. Oh, for God's sake. Look where it put me. Seriously? Yeah, this game is. I see it. I see it. Stupid. I see it. I see it. I'm sorry. It's not your fault. The game is just dumb. It's fine. Don't worry about it. I'll. We can either do open borders, and I can just keep exploring, or whatever. I don't really care. I already sent you the deal. Okay, so it's fine. Do you mind? Do you mind if I keep taking him west for a little while and exploring some? No, I don't care. Okay, you might fine. as well. Okay. I have nothing to hide. <laughs> Yet. <laughs> Yet. The day will come, but today is not that day. Right. I have no military. Like all my military is out and about somewhere. Uh, I see the warrior. That's cute. 
Tell you what, Kaden, I'll just I'll just pause my dude so that you don't have to worry about him. Choose research. Let's get sailing done. Now, now you're swapping. There we go. Get this done. No, nope, we're doing it right Raptor now. Raptor Puddin is telling me I should have charged you for the open borders. <laughs> I mean, probably, but it's done now, so F it. Yes. That's right. My name is Quark, everyone. That explains the ears. That explains a lot, doesn't it? Yeah. I mean, when you put it that way. <laughs> My chat says, perhaps today is a good day to die. Okay, Worf. <laughs> you know what my nickname for Worf is? The, un the, the Trek's most unlucky man? I don't know. Or luckiest, depending on how you define it. That's true. I mean, he... Well, I don't know about Kaylair, but he did end up marrying one of the hottest women in Trek otherwise. Uh, well, yes, and he also dated uh, the other one. Oh, I dated <laughs> Troy. That's true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He dates Troy. Ends up with Jadzia and then has a has a one off with uh, Esri. At the at the same <laughs> so, time, know. at the same time, the man was widowed twice. So like, yes. So maybe not the luckiest guy. I don't know. <laughs> I always called him intergalactic. Sorry, Lover Andrew. Because uh, as soon as he shows up, yeah, things the sparks are gonna fly. Is that <laughs> is that Kirk for short? See, Kirk at least it's expected. With Worf, it's like, oh crap, when's it coming? When's it gonna happen? I mean, there is. I mean. I was I was like low key waiting for him to show up on Voyager one day. Like, oh, <laughs> that would have been a really be a neat trick, huh? Too. Why not? That would have been a really neat trick, huh? Mm. I'm definitely going to settle down here, and I think eventually it's because I'm going to find oil, or I'm going to be able to put Ad uh, Admonson Research down here. But I mean, Kilimanjaro can feed any city that I can build down here, right? I could very easily do. City, um, harbor. No, I can't do that quite the way I want. Um, no, do it this way. Do uh, city, harbor, commercial district, and then all. I, I get these four tiles of food, which will be amazing. And plus, I'm far enough away when it erupts, I'm not going to get destroyed. And then, with these two tiles, I can build something, I don't know, over here still, and still get a little bit more out of the food. Plus these two tie fish tiles. I can build something down here, and they'll be they'll 100% be oil uranium down here in the late game. That'll be good. Fate protects fools, children, and ships named Enterprise, Ice Rose. What's up, Alaskan? It's a fools, nice city, Hunter Kitten. Fools, children, and ships named Enterprise. Yeah, everyone's waiting for the be the sh be a shame. What? I can't give you a compliment. I've known you too long. Aww. Okay, Vices is down here too. There's a city-state here. Okay. I'm going to need to move fairly quickly. Um, Munich's going to go to here. I'm going to get this city started so I can try for Stonehenge. <laughs> Chat's actually agreeing with you, kitten. Um, <laughs> I am sad. But See? if I'm going to if I'm gonna pick See? up Kilimanjaro, I'm going to have to do it very quickly. So I will uh, start heading in that direction. We all my... know you too. I'm just going to slam another settler out of Munich. Oh, by I, the way, oh, I hate doing this this quickly, but, but I feel like oh, I don't goody. have much choice. Uh, yeah, it was a really well done uh, uh, okay. research drawing, whatever you want to call it. Archery, yes, please. Well, and Logo? the crazy part is, is Saturday night we were playing cards against two Humanity turns, two turns from this. Our new graphics artist, because she's a personal friend, and I was telling her while we were sitting there talking in game what I wanted, and by the next day she had it drawn out, like it was beautiful. That is very impressive. Raptor, where are you planning on putting that settler so I don't like block him? Which one? The 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 one near your slinger over there? 
Yeah, I'm just he's, exploring. He's going him. one more hex to the northeast and then building. Got it. Okay. So I'll just go the other way then. I'm gonna I'm in the next five turns or so, five to eight turns, I'm gonna slam out three new cities. I'm gonna double the size of my empire very quickly here. What's up, Paladin? We're working on it, man. We're working on it. I have to outrush Zath to some decent territory here, which, as you're well aware, is not always friggin' easy. Because the guy's a f fucking locust. He just sees it and grabs it. Take, 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 take. Must take everything. Must take all the things. So all right. Build that. You're coming south. Ah, uh, you're going too far. Hold on. Cancel that move. That's too far. You're going to here. There we go. Yes, exactly. Mine, 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 mine. Zath the Seagull. 100%. Oh, Zath, you son of a bitch. What's the matter? Chocolate Hills is one of the best natural wonders, and you, like, just... It just, just like, started next to it. This is ridiculous. Oh, sorry. You weren't supposed to see that. Ah, well, you should you shouldn't have given me open borders then. <laughs> I'm just kidding. You, you giant really jerk. Mm. All right, next. So we're gonna build An here. Equal opportunity pisser offer, I guess. I guess. All right, I'm gonna bring this guy back now. I'm gonna need him. Time to build. Yes, we're removing the rainforest. All right, Madge, what else are we doing? Get over here. So, Raptor, apparently Amazon is having, like, a special spring sale. And included in that sale is Babylon 5, the Blu-ray set. Ah, very nice. Good choice. $75. That's pretty good. I think, what was it when it first came out? Like, 80 uh, Pre-order was like ninety-five or something. Yeah. Okay, that's not bad. Oh God, yeah. I mean, I I showed my wife right. My first purchases on Amazon were literally Babylon Five. I created an account <laughs> for buying Babylon Five. No, that's Amazon. funny. That's funny. And that was back when the DVD sets were seventy-five a piece. And I, I think, gladly bought them. I don't remember paying that much. I think I paid about forty a pop. That sounds right, but I could be wrong. Yeah, I was one of the people that just, like, immediately grabbed it. Because I'm like, I want. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, That's definitely. Like, Shut up and take my money! Yeah, 100%. Oh, no, seriously. It, it's uh, it's people like me and then later Raptor that, that convinced Warner Brothers to keep releasing the DVDs. And then eventually, 20-odd years later, the frickin' Blu-rays finally. Hold on a minute. If I were to build Roar, this would be legal, right? I have to build it. On a floodplains tile. Okay, so I'm going to mark that down. And that means if I want to build Great Bath, I could build it here. But then that makes this... That ends up making this a theater district. Which is not amazing. Whoa, why did you go down? Oh, because I'm taking the resource away. Yeah, okay. Dicey, kids, dicey. Or I could try and build... I can't build... Roar has to be adjacent to a... Uh, fact... A, um, um, industrial complex, right? Adjacent to industrial zone. Yeah, okay. So I could build Great Bath, but I have to build it somewhere else. Now, I'm not going to lie. I don't really care about Great Bath. Must be built on a flood. Did you build style. Berlin and then suddenly it floods like the next turn? No, it was flooded when I built there. What's up, Mikey? Yeah, well, that's not as bad, I might I guess. try and build... Uh, the problem is if I I hate build, when that happens. If know? I build Great Bath up here, I'm not going to get a lot of use out of Great Bath in this city. Just forget it. That's not... Also, that's shout pointless. out to the barbarians who put pointless, a galley pointless, pointless. in a one-tile um, lake. Let's... The water mill is probably my best early pick up there.
My chat concurs that Barbarian Lake Navies are hilarious. Oh, they're wonderful, aren't they? Like, seriously, don't go here. Swimming on a lake beach. Okay, so that's mildly irritating. Um, da, 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 da. Uh, it's going to be a bit before I can build a wonder. I'm going to found at least a city of the turn the next two turns. Encampment, no. Religion, I want to. How close am I to founding a religion? Okay, let's look at policies for starters. Uh, I got my... I think I can get away from God King now, which would be good. Urban planning, I think, is a good pickup. Let me come back to this in a minute. Yes, 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 I'm not done yet. I have a Pantheon. I am not generating profit points yet, but that is going to change soon. So, in the meantime, I don't care about the faith. Let's get urban planning put in. I need that. Uh, that'll be fine for now. And then I need... Yep, you're still doing this thing. Yes. Yes. No. Shrine, please. Um, and then... Okay, so it's a it's it's what am I picking over here? It's gonna be a bit before I found a religion. It's more likely that I'm gonna be I'm probably not gonna be at the target of an early declaration. Okay, 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 that's great, wonderful. All right, so now, Madgeberg, when you're done with that, we're gonna have to put a campus in. Let's get that going. And then, ladies and gentlemen, things are gonna start to feel a little better. Ooh, look at this. What are we building here? Edmonanki. Interesting. Oh, he's building it in the marsh tile. That's fine. All right. Uh, needs orders. Uh, just keep exploring down here. There's probably, there's probably at least one more goody hut down here at the bottom of the map. I just haven't found it yet. All right, at least I won't be in a dark age next time. I still have an out. I still have a shot at a heroic age. I'd say it's not. I won't say it's likely. It is possible. The heroic age is possible. Bam. Let's go. Let's freaking go. <clears throat> All right. Get the water mill in. You get your ass back here. You're going to get founded next turn. These mountains make a very handy between a border between Zath and I, but it's going to be a bit of a mess. All right, um, next turn. It's time for you to do something useful. Why don't you get up here and form and um, you know what? Can I do something else in Madge? I can. Let's put in a monument and I'll chop it out so that we're not losing that resource. And I need to start building builders like effing crazy. I am way behind that curve right now. Feels terrible. I have decent city locations, but moving around on this terrain is a massive hassle, to put it lightly. Hold on a minute. Um, Andrew, it does a little bit. I can't argue that. I will say that it doesn't show as bad as you think, right? I mean, yes, it's not ever going to be a photorealistic CGI, right? But it doesn't, it's still to, they, in, when you look at the upscales that they've done, it holds up pretty well. Like, it really does.
Okay. I can build Stonehenge. Do I want to bother? I think the answer is yes. Let's go let's double up on the let's double up on the wonders in the hope that it matters. I mean double up on the religion founding in the hope that I can I can get there, right? I just I need to get there somehow. That's fair, Lionheart. I don't disagree with you. I don't disagree with you at all. Okay, Munich's got one more settler coming out, which is going down here. And I want to try and be able to maybe sneak one more city in, like right here, maybe. Maybe? Maybe. This might not even be terrible. It might not even be bad for if I could do city. This gets awkward, but hear me out. City, harbor, canal. No? I can't build it on the hills. So no canal there. Feels bad. Okay, so that city doesn't work. My thought was put the city inside the lake, connect the lake to the ocean, but no, that doesn't work. So that's all right. We'll get down there and we'll claim, we'll claim Kilimanjaro and then we'll figure out the rest of it. I'm going to have a ton of mountains here for national, national parks when the time comes, which is nice. I probably need to take this guy to here and this guy over here as quick as I can. Um... Yeah, I got to think about how kind of the best way to manage some of this stuff is, but we're not doing badly. I need to keep growing north like, more than likely. I can squeeze probably a city in here, depending on the terrain, and then I probably am going to want to look here, maybe even maybe even over here. This might be ambitious, but I think it's worth looking at. This is ambitious, but his capital must be over here somewhere. This is going to be an amazing city for me when the time comes. I can't wait. Oh, so good. So good. Um, I also, I, I'm going to go ahead and put a, uh, a builder in the queue here. We're going to need it. Keep, really get the growth kick started. Which movies, Andrew? He's He has seen the, um, um, the animated one. I have not. I own it. I have not watched it yet because I'm lazy. Um... I've seen all the other ones, right? Like in the beginning in third space and all of that. I've seen all of those. I never did see Legend of the Rangers, which I'm not convinced is good. You hear very mixed opinions on that one. What am I doing on cash? All right, I want you to finish up your settler and then crank me out, I think... Two builders, I think. Oracle might be good. Where would I put this? Lots of options. Um, I like the idea of maybe doing Oracle back here and then eventually building Panama Canal and then eventually like putting like a theater square here or something. That has some appeal to it. Let me put, I'm going to put two builders in the queue, though, because by God, we need them. The non-enemy ones. So there's actually three, Andrew. There's third space in the beginning and... Um, what's the one with the soul hunters? They did one with soul hunters. Was that, was that third space? No, that wasn't third space. I can't think of it. That's going to bug the crap out of me. Hold on. That's going to bug the crap out of me. There was, oh, the one that started Crusade. Call to Arms. Call to Arms is the one I'm thinking of. River of Souls. That was it. So you had River of Souls, Third Space, and In the Beginning. And then they did Call to Arms, which was like the, the intro to Crusade. So it's kind of a movie. Kind of a movie, right? I'm going to move this guy down here and we're going to chop down this rainforest as well to help speed along the um, 
the uh the well raptor i built the city and had it flood immediately after yeah i it. saw that happen that was unfortunate but it does happen mm -hmm. we were... go ahead you were saying no i'm just saying that that's that's true Choose civic. Let me come back to that. How we how we doing here? All right. Somebody's gonna beat me to probably beat me to founding a religion, but I don't know who. Uh, government cards. None of this is amazing yet. Okay, it's time for political philosophy. I don't know why I didn't do that before. Mostly because I'm dumb, apparently. Um, guild master. We're gonna put you in Munich. No, we're going to put you in Berlin. No, we're going to put you in Cologne. I'm not risking that city going about going south on me. All right, Frankfurt, what are we doing? Um, Granary, and then... Hold on. Holy Sight Prayers, then Granary. I'm going to go ahead and build Stonehenge just because it's a wonder... And therefore, really awesome for Ludwig. Not, and plus, if I do it, it prevents some, somebody else from doing it. So that's something. I'm doing okay, Necro. Welcome in. It's kind. I won't call it an easy wonder. That's a lie. But it's a wonder, and therefore, I think worth worth exploring. Um, let's go ahead and get this iron mine in place. You, I'm gonna, yes, and yes. Okay. I want to get this city founded so I can I can be near Kilimanjaro. And then I'll maybe do a little more exploring here. This might be an island. This looks like it might be an island. Why don't we go ahead and build a couple of galleys? What are my actually what are these what do these guys want? Encampment. Well that's gonna be a little bit before I get to there. Although maybe not as far as I, maybe not as long as I think, because if I, I really kind of want to do that. Let's, let's, how long do I have until the next age? You're four turns from a water mill, and after that you're several turns from an encampment. If I wanted to buy the builder outright, it would be 140. Mm, we'll see how it goes. For now, we're going to do that. Um... I want to put some galleys in the queue. Probably two galleys. Give me a navy started. Let's get a granary in and a monument. I don't need the monument. Hold the rest. Um, and then I think it's time we got Frankfurt a campus put in. Let's do granary. Let's do holy site prayers to get my get my religion started. Into granary, into builder. Yeah, and then I'll start. I'll chop this out and and put in a um, uh, a campus over there. Let's go and get horseback riding done because I can. Oh my God, the Galapagos! Hey, that's kind of good, you know. Yeah, well, I'm nowhere near it. Uh, um, I don't need granary yet. Not a complaint, Actually, by the way. It's just a fact of life, you know. Let's get a builder slammed out. That would be useful. That would be useful. <laughs> That's so funny, Andrew. I never even thought about that. I have watched so little of that show, it would never even have dawned on me that was even a thing. Uh, iron mine, please. Thank you. All right. Iron working. Apprenticeship. All right. Madgeburg. Okay. Yep. 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 Okay. We are almost guaranteed a heroic age now, which is good. We desperately need it. I'm going to bring him back for that. Let's take you south. There we go.
Uh, library, please, I think. And then let's go library into archer. I need some military. I have like no military. I'm like wide open for the taking here. And then we'll put an encampment down out here, please. I did that wrong. We should do library into encampment into archer. Let's try that. Uh, how am I doing on trade routes? Only one. Okay, I need to get some commercial hubs built as well. I want to get these two encampments to stabilize my border with Vices. This one with Zath is a little... He's a little farther away. I'm not super concerned about it just yet. That is... Yeah, Stavros, that's correct. I think Jag was still on the air when B5 was airing, right? Like, it, it, I don't recall it being that much of an overlap with NCIS. Okay. Ooh, let's do this. Hold on a minute. Cancel his move. I'll get these fish done before I bring him in to get this pasture done. Let's do that. I could even be looking at... Possibly, I could be looking at... I could be looking at Golden Gate right here. I actually have a legal title for Golden Gate Bridge. Worth looking into. Worth keeping in mind. Choose Civic. Theology, that we're about to found a religion. That's going to happen like this round, I think. Yep. Okay. Choose religion. We've been doing the waves and, then, and the Church of Hindenburg. All right, now, let's pick some theoretically good stuff. Work ethic. Work ethic would, would be crazy. Do I need that? I don't think I do. Jesuit education has some appeal, given the, the, given the type of victory I am attempting to win. Um, feed the world also has some appeal, given the terrain that I'm stuck with. Um, divine inspiration has some appeal because I'm I'm incentivized to build wonders. I've been using I've been going divine inspiration in previous builds. I, it's it's one that I wouldn't normally do, but I think I'm gonna I'm gonna go with that here. Um, and then I think what I want is I want cathedrals, but I'm gonna come back to cathedrals. I've been I've been messing with sacred places because I think that's just a nice solid bonus. Um. Each campus or commercial hub and industry provides two science or two gold. See, that stewardship also has some value for sure. Um, I think what I want, though, is holy order to start. Yep. that's We're, we're going to try that. New government. Hey, all right. Um, I think we want to do autocracy. I think we want autocracy. We're going to do autocracy for now. Um, that's going to let me grab... Yeah, I know. Call me Hakuna Yurtatas, kids. We're working on it. And then... Uh... I'm going to... That's probably not amazing, but I'm doing it anyway. Um, the rest of this I'm actually okay hey, with for now. Yeah, let's do that. Yo. Just so you know, I'm going to settle by the mountains to the uh, east of Argos, and then I'm not planning on going past there, okay? I mean, I have nowhere else to go but east of Argos. There's nowhere else for me to go. Well, that is unfortunate. <laughs> okay, well, I can back <laughs> off one like, city well, then. Tough crap to, to you. <laughs> I would appreciate it. Love that. It's just like, I'm literally right. socked in now. I've got vices because... everywhere. Oh my god. Ew. You have caught a terminal case of the vices? I have. You have died of <laughs> vicentary? <laughs> vicentary? <laughs> Jesus. Alright, so uh, we'll, we'll so make the mountain funny. range a natural border then. Sound good? So Sounds funny. Alright. It's like that line from um, Much Ado About Nothing. Mm. Oh lord. Heaven help him if he hath caught the Benedict. 
<laughs> Ape, Civ 6 has been out long enough. You ought to be able to get it pretty cheap on Steam if you're really interested. Um, I don't have a link for you at the moment, but I know it's not expensive anymore. They've been trying... like. The game has basically had all its expansions and all its downloadable content, and like you can get like everything all bundled up for like fifteen bucks right now. Like, it's in the, it's towards the end of its life while they work on the sequel. Let's put it that way. Zat's military score uh, bothers me quite a bit, I must say. Ah, hold on. Do I have enough for one of these guys? Yes, please. Okay, there we go. Get a mercenary. Get, get a missionary out, so we can go to Madgeburg. Ape, I gotta say, Civ 6 is a great game. The, the entire Civilization, um, the entire Civilization series in general is pretty good. Not every single one of them has been amazing. I won't, I won't go that far. That's that would be an exaggeration. But in general, they are quite good games. I did not care for Civ 3 very much. Um, I liked Civ 4. I played the hell out of Civ 5. And I've played. I don't know. How many hours of this game have I played? Hang on a minute. I can look. <laughs> 1,100. Yeah, I have 1,100 hours welcome. of Civilization VI. So there you go. To Jurassic Park. Daddy, welcome in. Thank you for the follow. So, you can... The game is programmed with some maps that are, in fact, based on real life. Um, however, it is more common that players will play with randomly generated maps. But the game, the game has both available. If you want to play a historical map, you absolutely can. Ooh, interesting. This was not at all what I expected to find over here. I don't think we can squeeze a city in here. One, two, three. But I can... One, one, two, one, two. I could squeeze a city right here, though. Right here. That, that's not great, but it wouldn't be... There's worse spots. Hmm. Okay, I got to look at this. Shipbuilding, please. Let's run south so I can find out what the hell's going on. All right, what am I doing with you? Uh, what am I doing with you? These have both been farmed. I put a quarry in. I've got a diamond mine. Um, let's chop this out. Since eventually I'm going to put a factory thingy in there. Um, come to Munich, I think. Or start with Matchburg. Start with Matchburg. <clears throat> There's some actually decent terrain up here amongst all this tundra. Can I squeeze a city? Yeah, I can squeeze a city in along this river somewhere. This would not be bad up here for me. One city here. Maybe I can probably squeeze a city in here. I got to look at the terrain. Got to get a scout down there and have a peek. All right. Let's get drama and poetry going. I'm close to Stonehenge, which is wonderful. What are my policy cards? Do I need this? I don't need this right now. I'll want that later. I don't care about it right now. Ironworking, shipbuilding, theology. Vice is built at a Menonke. That's fine. 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 Okay. Daddy, no worries. Welcome in. Appreciate you. If you have questions, let us know. We're happy to help. There's quite a few of us either on camera or in chat that can help you with any questions you have about Civ 6. There's a lot to take in in this game. So don't, do not hesitate and don't ever feel bad about asking questions. I've been playing for a very, very long time and it's still very common for me to go, I didn't know that and learn something new. So don't ever feel bad. Okay, here's what I wanna do. I think I wanna reposition this guy to Ulm and run a trade route to this city state and that'll give me a nice road up through the center of the empire here so let me reposition him to transfer to me uh ohm there we go. okay uh temple no i'm gonna buy the temple no i can't yet <laughs> it's okay we'll get to that uh let's get this campus put in kids i just got this builder down 
Why don't we do something else? I don't want, I don't think I want hanging gardens in this city. I don't think I want hanging gardens at all. I would love Colosseum. Where could I put Colosseum that would be amazing? Let me think about this for a minute. Um, that is a great spot for that. If I were to put Colosseum here, let's just, let's do some tag, let's do some bookmarks for a minute. If I was to do Colosseum here, one, two, so that gets me, that gets me five cities worth of Colosseum, right? Because that's how it works. Plus two amenities to each city, you're it within, each city center within six tiles. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, all five. So basically most of the empire right there. And plus one, two, three, four, five, six. No, I won't be able to get anybody up here. But that's pretty solid still. I'm getting five cities with extra amenities. In order to support that, I have to put in an entertainment district. So let's say I put him right here. And then after I do that, I'm going to want to put in a theater square. That is not bad. I really like that. I really like that. So let's start then with... I haven't discovered, the, uh, uh, but I can. I cannot build... Okay, let's get the entertainment complex put in first. Because I want to beat I want to beat Zath the Coliseum, because he'll absolutely build it if I don't. All right, we got our water mill in. Let's do a monument. And let's start growing the city a little faster. Let's get up here and chop some... Actually, no, I don't want to chop that. I want to chop the forest that this guy is sitting on. Okay. Um, come back this way. All right, um, you're going to here now. That'll create a nice trade route through the through this heart of the empire, which is what I'm after. Now I want to remove this. That'll finish Stonehenge, which I don't need, but I don't care. I stole it from somebody else. That's all I care about. Um, let's put in a granary, I think. And we got we got a free apostle. Oh, I love that. We can immediately evangelize. That'll be amazing. So that's good to know. I've never had to do that. I've never done that before. That'll be fun. Done what? So when you build Stonehenge after you founded a religion, the great prophet is useless. So it doesn't give you a great prophet. It gives you a free apostle. Right. That's nice. I've never, like I said, I've never done that. Didn't know that was a thing. It is nifty. I could build Apadana right here. That would be legal. Where's Apadana? You crazy son of a bitch. DJ's man. back with the resub. Thank you, DJ. How you doing, my friend? How are you? Where's Apadana? It's very early. Apadana. No. It must be just. Oh, okay. Ugh, there's not me. So many only so many places I can do that. That's kind of crappy. You know, Rita, I actually have no idea where in the country it's located. Where is it? Oh, I feel your pain, DJ. I feel your pain. Welcome in, Rita. Can you get a shout out for Rita and for DJ, please? DJ doesn't stream much, but he does do his monthly um, his monthly Q and A session. I would love for folks to uh, to go check that out sometime. Oh man, I really think I'm gonna want Oracle in Frankfurt. I'm really gonna want Oracle like here. Can I build Oracle like right here? Can I build an oracle here? Is that legal? Yes. Okay, that's where I want oracle. I gotta find another, another wonder to put here. All right, Munich. I'm still working on you. Um, I think we're gonna go back to settler. Choose belief. I think now is the time to pick up. I took this. I think what I want now is um. I either want sacred places or cathedral. I think I'm gonna want to go cathedral. I think I want Cathedral. But we're going to start 
we're gonna start with sacred places. Cathedral doesn't do me much good right this very right this instant, but I think it will in the long run. Uh, chop this out. Eh, whatever. Uh, okay. I need to buy this tile in order to chop it out. So, I've got a little bit of cash. Salisbury Plain in Wiltshire. Two miles... That, that, that... That, none of, none of, none of that helps me. I don't know where Salisbury is. Is this like East Anglia or something? So this is not an ocean. This is a giant lake. This is a giant lake. In order for me to connect over here, I'm going to have to build a city here and put in like a damn... Oh, man, what a mess. Okay, can I build? I can build over here, but man, it's dicey. Woof. Okay. Well, I've got, I'm cranking out some settlers, so we'll see how this goes. I definitely still want to build this city for sure. West of Portsmouth. West of Portsmouth. So it's along the southern coast, Rita? Really? I didn't know that. That's interesting. So, Flaming, my plan is to build Panama Canal which, here, but that doesn't do me any good. Now, if I build over here, I have another opportunity to build Panama Canal. But I also don't know what's over here yet. Like, it feels like there's not a lot of ocean I don't know. This is a very odd map right now. I'm feeling it's. I'm. I'm honestly. I'm genuinely confused by the map I'm looking at. Uh, recorded history. Let's do military training. I'm two turns from getting that boost, so we'll get that done. Yeah, I'm building two encampments right now. Not worth visiting. So DJ, I've actually had that thought as well. I mean, Mexico City is solid. This is a great bonus, right? Um, I mean. Mexico City's bonus is pretty amazing, but I think what I'm going to do right now while I've got that policy card in is pick up my free envoys and at least get the bonuses from uh, what's going into the capital. I will probably try to pick up Mexico City for suzerainty because I think it'll be useful eventually. It's not useful right this moment, but it will be useful uh, at some point in the future. Okay, so right now I have literally two landlocked galleys that I can do basically nothing with, which feels a little sad. Um... I'm going to keep one down south. Uh, and then... Uh, what am I going to do with you? I think I'm going to march you across the river. Hold on, Frankfurt. I need you to buy another tile. Because we're going to start you in Coliseum right now. Oh, okay. No, we're going to build an arena first. Fine, we're going to build an arena first. Okay. Then you're going to come over here. Do this. Thank you. All right, so I can see now that my open borders thing with Zath has expired. Um, so why don't we send him another... What's it? Oh, I never sent him a delegation. That was dumb. Um, make deal. Make deal. We'll see if he takes it. I literally, I literally don't care. If he doesn't want to take it, if he doesn't want it, that's fine. All right, Berlin. What are we doing in Berlin? I need a... I really need my industrial zones, but I'm not there yet. Uh, are there any good with Huey spots for Huey? Um, truthfully, no, because the game is classifying everything as C's. If I was going to build Huey, I'd want to try and do it down here in the, in the frozen hell of the bottom of the map, because those are actually lakes. But it gets weird at that point. Very weird. Um, what am I doing here? Where am I? I'm in Berlin. Um, I think what I want to do is that, and let's get the encampment put in. There we go. Thank you for the shout outs. Thank you guys for giving the shout outs. Uh, and we need to get one for DJ as well.
Oh, I have to wait. I have to wait an hour. Somebody must have hit him up. Somebody must have gotten one. There we go. Okay. Somebody got him. Perfect. Excellent. You guys make sure you throw Deej and Rita some follows. <clears throat> is the total map size fixed? So, Wayne, when you roll up a game of Civ, the map size is fixed based on the settings that you um, lock in when you create the game. So whatever those settings are, that's what that's that's what you get. All right, Dortmund. I probably should have waited. I should have waited on that city, but I, at this point it's done and I don't really care. It's done. It would have been three era score for the next era if I had just done it, but whatever. Screw it. Um, give me a builder, please. I'll start farming up some of this fish or whatever. All right, mathematics. And then I'm not ready for temples yet. I'll go ahead and go in on recorded history, even though I'm not going to get a second district down for a spell. Um, all right, let's come down here and do Munich, please. Um, let's do, for now, let's go ahead and make a, make a farm out of you. I need you to come over here. However you get there, just figure it out. Okay, what happened here? I sent Zath a deal and got nothing back. Okay, so kitten built hanging gardens. Free envoy. Yep. Don't really care. Okay, send envoy. Let's go ahead and pick up Mexico City. Okay. Okay. How curious. I definitely want to try to settle down here if I can swing it. Like, this would be perfect. Actually, this would probably be perfect. Build the city here. Okay, let's look at this for a minute. If I did city, commercial hub, harbor, my holy trio, then, check this out, I want to do aqueduct, Hansa. Ooh, this is getting good. And then I just need a dam. Put a dam across the river. Dam it right here. Dam. That looks pretty good, kids. And, and, if I want to go crazy, if I can get up here. I mean, campus or, campus or holy site. Like, that's not bad. Plus, then a single canal will get me through this, this little isthmus here. There's a lot to like there. And that is a legal build. I would have to buy up a whole bunch of tiles. I think this next settler that's coming out of Munich is going to make... That's that's his journey. That's his job. Perfect. Okay. So, Zath, have I screwed up? I'm, I'm sending you an open borders request, and I'm not seeing a response. Did, I, did it not go through? I have not seen it. I apologize. Okay, no, that's um... not your fault. That's the game's fault. Let me try again. Yeah, I'm not ignoring you. That's for sure. I, I wasn't worried about that. Let me see if I can... Let me cancel it and try, and try again. Yeah, last thing I remember from you was a uh, Envoy. Okay, try that. Right, Maybe we'll it went through that time. All right, Ulm. I'll check. I'm trying to do build queue right now. Let's go ahead and get the commercial hub put down. Uh, let's chop this. Yep, I got it. Thank you. All right. Okay. What is he? Three Ram Thomas from the classical reader. Okay, so. Education, Celestial, Military Tactics, and Buttress. 
And we got an Envoy out of that. Okay. Lord Zath accepts your deal. Marvelous. Thank you. Marvelous. Marvelous. Excellent. I love all of this. Okay. For now, let's put in a farm. Do, 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 do. Because what I can do is, if I can build these two cities, I can still plunk one along this lake somewhere, and there's a lot of food to be had. Like, this would still... This is still not a terrible spot for a city right there. Because I can eventually pick up these two tiles of Kilimanjaro to go with these two fishing tiles to go with, you know, some of this other stuff off to the north. Like, it's not bad. It's sustainable. I have a sneaking suspicion I am eventually going to end up conquering Mexico City. The terrain is too good, and it's too close to Korea's borders to, to leave it to not, to like not, right? Can't put a canal there? No, I can't put a canal here. I could put a canal over here, which is what I'm talking about, right? I mean, those are hills. You can't cut a canal through a hills tile? Yeah, you're right. Can't be hills. Well, that's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. That's stupid because they literally built the Panama Canal for giant hills. With enough dynamite, you could do anything. <laughs> that's, just, that's stupid. All right, Madgeberg. What do we got cooking? Barracks, please. Walls feel good. And eh, Busan beat me up here, but it is what it is. Hold on, Cologne. There, there's my border. Congratulations. Um, one, two, ooh, hold on. He can still choke me out of this ocean if I'm not careful. I've definitely got to put a city over here. Okay. Time to go back on a building spree, apparently. A city building spree. Um, did I ever get a... I have a builder in the queue. I need a settler, and I need him yesterday. That's too long. Munich, just keep cranking them out, buddy. My, my capital has, like, done nothing but build settlers, and I legit feel bad for them. Um, but it's, the, it's, it's where we're at right now. I might could get one out of Madge. Maybe. It's not great, but it's not terrible. Eh, we'll figure it out. Yeah, I guess so, Night Owl. I don't know. I got nothing. It doesn't make any sense to me either. Mathematics. All right. So here's my heroic age, which I'm a big fan of. All right. I can make three dedications. Um, I think we definitely want monumentality. Uh, and then I think we just do these three. Drums of War does not do me anything. Plus some production culture from encampments. I mean, I've got to have three encampments. Drums of War is not bad, but it's not amazing. You see, you receive two culture and one gold for your specialty district. Commercial hubs and harbors provide gold. I mean, yeah, that's this is this these top three are the obvious choices. This is not amazing for me, really, in my mind. It's worth a little bit of culture and production, but I don't think it's worth it to give up the other ones. So life's gonna feel pretty good for for a while. Uh, let's do feudalism, please. Hop in there. Chill for a spell. Governor title. Uh, land acquisition. Dortmund. Thank you. You're fine where you're at. You're getting chopped. Okay.
flip them? Flip them how? Oh, he's going to beat me to it. He's going to beat me to this spot, the little bastard. Man, that is frustrating. I'm literally sailing a settler over there right now. But I, I can't stop him without going to war. I can still take Mexico City. The Mexico City bonus is good. It's not game deciding. 100% tour production in city center, please. Sure, I'll vote for me. I legit don't care about this. I care more about that. <clears throat> sure. Whatever. Fine. I think I might be able to... Yeah, I know, Ching. The, the question is, am I going to be able to flip them? And that's a question that I can't answer just yet. Right? I mean, he's got so much loyalty pressure up there. I don't know how easy it's going to be. So, um, Vices, Kitten, we haven't heard much from you guys. How are things going? Going pretty good. Just trying to finish up the last of my cities. Now, you said... Okay, yeah, I see you built roads now. Okay. And I'm doing fine. I'm just growing. Ouch, Raptor, somehow you beat Kitten despite voting the same amount. Really? That's odd. Yeah. I mean, could I go to war with Vices? I could. Rude. Is it worth it? I don't know. I genuinely don't know right now. Like that is that is a tough call. Um, I gotta think about this for a bit. I'm gonna bring my Navy back south. Okay, so that's a coast. I need to be getting more out of my capital than settlers, but I just can't because I'm busy trying to get everything else online, which is just brutally, brutally messing with me right now. I might be able to flip boosts on if I can get some city pressure up here. I'm going to need to get another settler that I don't have, which is really irritating. Um, so I got to work on some stuff, clearly. There was rice here. I guess it got destroyed in... Okay, yeah. When this when this volcano went off, it ate the rice. Yay. Oh well, whatever. I'll manage. Without spies, I feel like I'm gonna have a hard time flipping those cities, right? Now this is surprising. I would not come this far south. I'm not sure where he's going with this. If he comes all the way down here, I am going to build in behind him. A hundred percent. I'll dump a governor in there. I'll put units in there. I will fight for that spot. That is a great city spot for me. This will eventually make a nice national park. So let me remember to mark that. There we go. And there was one over here. One, two, three. This, this will eventually make a nice national park. No, because it won't let me found it from there because the game is stupid. Now I'll have to figure it out. I'm not sure where he's going with this precisely. This is not a great spot. I guess he's going to continue going south. I want to keep an eye on you. Oh. 
<sighs> so frustrating. That's terrible, Night Owl. Get out. <laughs> That's terrible. You're fired. Get out. All right. Um, I'm four turns from Coliseum. I love all of that. I need to be working on food production in Frankfurt, it looks like. And I'm going to need another builder around Berlin very, 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 very soon. I should probably be looking into that. I've got one coming out of Cologne. I need to be probably buying some tiles... like this. I sort of care if he locks, gets these, but I sort of don't. I want them, don't get me wrong, but I'm not going to lose sleep. What I really want is the sea, the sea path out of here. I think in an eventual war with Vices, Busan is going to have to be one of my... Uh, okay, so there we go. He founded that city one hex farther south than I would have. Now, there's a possibility here... I think capturing it is not going to be simple. Um, however, I might, if I'm really clever, be able to flip it. Because it's kind of hung out there to dry. Come back here. No, 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 no. Stop that. Stop that. Stop that. Stop that. I'm going to bring you back the other way. Oh, actually, no, you have to do that. Yeah, 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 because of the way the terrain works. I have to take you out the slow way. Ooh. It's fine. We'll figure it out. This is not going to be a great city, um, but it's going to be a city. So I'll just have to figure it out. Yeah, I really hate what he's done with this place. I actually, I actually want to get in there and raise it. <laughs> I just want to raise that place. I really do. Um, I need more gold. With enough gold, I can probably do it. I probably need quad dreams. Can you, can you slam out a quad dream? That'd be amazing. Can you do that for me? Don't I have quad dreams? Yeah. Do that next. We want we want education or we want, no I think we want military tactics we want military tactics civic 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 I'm a long way from mercenaries not terribly far from civil service though uh bear uh, stable over here and a stable here as well and a granary granary then a stable. What I really want to do is raise that damn city. Like, I just want it to go away. Okay. This is good. If I can get a settler up here... Yep, I can found in this gap, and that will give me grant me better sea access. If I can build here, and then one, two, three... Somewhere along the river. Right along the river, like right here next to the geo, the, the geo stuff. So build a city, like, do like... Um, like this, and then like this. Something along those lines. It's not amazing, but it's not bad. Maybe even go farther down the Danube. Maybe do... Maybe do this. No, that doesn't work. Not the way I want it to. I like that deal, Kitten. That is a nice deal. Maybe do... Hold on a minute. I'm looking at this the wrong way. Do this. Um, Kitten, are you interested in open borders or no? At the moment, no. Okay. That's solid. And then gives me the access to the ocean from here that I need. Okay. I'm going to look into that going to be sloppy, but I think it's workable.
Hold on a minute. All right, Berlin. I could even build one here if I wanted, if I wanted. Let's get another city up here. Let me put another, let me put a, a settler in the queue here. That's kind of crap, but it is what it is. Yeah, stable going in, that's fine, okay. Mm -mm -mm. Kind of shoehorned in here. I really, it torques me off that this is just like a giant inland sea. I'd really hope this would be ocean. You don't mind if we uh, did a quick potty break? Nah, go ahead. All right, thank you. Sounds good to me, actually. Yeah, let's get up and stretch and stuff. I think that's important for everybody. This city pisses me off. Y'all's timing is great. I literally just came back. Not complaining, just... Oh, I'm sorry, man. You can always say be... something earlier if you need to, you know? I literally want to conquer it and raise it to the ground. I got quick access. Like, it's in I'm just good. such a terrible spot for me. Night Owl, I 100% agree. That's what I'm trying to do. But I got Korea in my way, right? And that, again, that pisses me off. Plus, there's a city-state just over here that I haven't discovered yet that I really need to get a unit over there and and, and, dis and discover, right? Um, let me also finish up with... Um, I need to get another Apostle done so I can finish evangelizing this turn. Go grab Cathedral and be done with it. I'm close to Colosseum. That will be another wonder. That's really, really good for me. Zath is building up a ridiculous military, which I'm sure is going to be a problem for me at some point. I'm going to have to build up a military if I'm going to take on Vices. He has more military score than I do right now. <sighs> have I gotten crossbowmen yet? No, I need machinery. Okay. One more archer and I can get it done. So I should plug an archer in. Okay, I need to keep that scout running this direction. I need to find out what's going on over here. So, DJ, the second one hasn't gotten here yet, and I keep forgetting to open the Paladin when we're doing our RPG sessions. We had a we had a Pathfinder session on Saturday, and I literally forgot to open it. Um. So no, I haven't I haven't tried them yet. I'm genuinely. <clears throat> There's a part of me that's almost afraid to open them, Deej, right? Because it's like, are they collectible? I mean, I realize you make the stuff to drink, but like, should I not? I don't know. Plus, I don't know how good it is. That's the thing with kind of, uh, you know, Bob's off-brand whiskey. You don't really know how good it is. I mean, is it good? It might be good. Is it crap? I don't know. Um, I actually haven't, I actually have not bothered to go look for like a, um... And I should. Um, yeah, here we go. Review. Here we go. The Whiskey Wash. They have a review it from the end of the year. Yep. Yep. Well, apparently it isn't terrible. Hundred proof. Yep, yep, yep. Selling through. Plans are going around. Okay. Okay. They didn't like the finish. 
but apparently the rest of it was okay. Interesting. Well, Deej, here's my thing. In my, I'm one of these people that I think if right, you don't drink it, for you're waiting. wasting your, like, you're crazy, right? Like, it's made to be drunk, right? The guys who distilled it no want worries. you to drink it. That's literally why they made it, right? Um, at the same time, oh my god, I've got to build this Hansa. This Hansa is I have amazing. his hand. All right. Raptor, are you good? Let's do it. Sorry, I was on another screen, but we got it going. No worries. Hmm. I can't buy apostles yet. Buy another missionary, get that part done at least. Um, Zath built Machu Picchu, which is really good for him. Something I keep saying where we should do and we never... I, I'm going to shout you all out because I keep forgetting. <laughs> see, see, now I'm just going to make you feel bad because I just want everyone here to know I always shout everybody else out <laughs> halfway through. I am lazy and almost never do because I am lazy and forget these things. I, yeah, I, I, I mean, I'm it's I'm kind of with Sea Raptor, which is why I tag y'all on my stream and everything. Yeah, I put you in the title for sure. Yeah, same oh, here. Same too. here. Same here. Same yep. here. So, I just I just did the shout out thing, and I did the Omega shout out for Vices. The Omega shout out. All right. I don't even know what that means. The Omega shout out. So you know, on Twitch, there's the ability to shout somebody out and then check and just click a button and follow automatically. Yeah. Um, and then there's uh, like a like a regular shout out you can do exclamation point so right, and then it puts a clip up or something. So okay, good uh, to the know. Mega Deej. shout out is your opinion in matters. My opinion, it's, it's the Twitch one that everybody can just click to follow because you can only do that once like an hour or something. I think. Yes, I think yes. So I figured let let's let's Omega shout out the host. You know, it's appreciated. All right, I need to stop building settlers for a little while. You're going here. Get on it, boyo. Ooh, you know what I could do? I could levy Mexico City's units. If I, okay, hold on a minute. Hold on a minute. Let's 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 look at this for a minute. There's Venice. Okay. I could levy Mexico City. If I levied Mexico City, I would have two catapults and a swordsman to go with the swordsman I've already got down here. Plus the galleys. That ought to be plenty to handle his single archer. I move up, I raise Suwon, I build my own city where I want it. I really like this idea. I really like this idea. It almost feels a little greedy, though. And he has he has an, um, uh, uh, he has more military than I do, right? Like this is not this is not up for debate. Um, I need to get another archer in the queue desperately somewhere, anywhere. Here, archer, build me a whole bunch of can archers. We're gonna build. We're gonna go archer crazy. Um, and then we're gonna get education done. You did it. You crazy son of a bitch, you did. Who was that? Black Duke! Thank you for the resub welcome in. All right. I'm 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 kind of there, Ice Rose, and, and and it feels a little bad, but I feel like I need to do that, right? And I don't. If I do it correctly, there's probably nothing he can do about it. His military is probably all concentrated north. What I can't afford is for him to get adventurous and smash me up north. 
If I levy Mexico City, what would it take? If I wanted to do it, what would it take to levy their military? Here we go. 240. I'm a little ways from being able to do it. So I need some cash. So it's going to be a hot minute before I can even consider it. All right, Colosseum is done. I think it's time I go ahead and put in the temple so I can finish evangelizing. Raptor, you jerk. You're welcome. You saw me building nope. it. You knew it was coming. I wasn't even building it. I'm just saying. Okay. <laughs> like you walked a unit right by the the, the it under construction. I, I figured and you would see it. That is correct. I, I yeah. did. Um, my tourist did see you building it. Um, do I want to go ahead and get Oracle down? It's not going to let me. Good build position for it because that helps. Uh, I've got like five, five yeah, cities. It covers five cities. I'm pretty happy with that spot. Yeah. I hadn't really you considered it until about like 15 turns ago. And then I looked at it and went, I should probably do that while I still can. And just went mm. and did it. I do not blame you one bit. Okay. Let's, let's do some things in the interim. Let's get the, let's build the campus. Let's get some builders cranked out so we can clean up the, ter the terrain a little bit. And then I think I want to go ahead and build... After that, we'll put Oracle in the ground. That might be a mistake, but I can't afford to spend the cash anywhere else right now. Let's do one builder, then Oracle, then another builder. Okay. Ulm is completed with things. Mark it. And then give me another trader. I desperately need another trader. And you're not letting me do it. Why do I have to... Oh, I have to build the market. The market gives me the trade route capacity. Duh. Okay. Uh, let's go over here and build an iron mine. Okay. I think I'm going to make this play with... I think I'm going to make this play with, against Korea. But I'm going to... I cannot wait for very long. If I'm going to do it, I need to do it relatively quickly. What is the bonus that Venice provides? Trade routes give gold extra gold. She's got that super locked up. Whatever. It's fine. Just stay back there. I don't want it to know I have a settler nearby, but I need it nearby. I know, right, Ice Rose? And I need to get a city put in here somewhere. Probably right here. This wouldn't be bad. This is not amazing, but I've seen worse tiles. It at least gives me the whole valley to settle. Um, putting it right on here on the bananas is probably a better gig. One, two, three. That would make this also a legal settle spot, which is what I really want, so I can get this canal put in eventually. That is going to eventually connect me to this ocean somewhere. This ocean layout has me super confused. Mm. Like, what I thought was an okay. ocean, it turns out to be a really big inland sea, and then I have yet to find, like, a proper ocean. Civic, civics, 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 civics. We're slowly building up to that. Yeah, seriously, Night Owl, that's what it feels like right now. Uh, I don't care about that. That's fine. Wonderful. Yeah, I know. I knew that was a thing. Okay, they get the granary put in. Okay, good. Put the walls in after, I suppose. I should really build an archer here. I should really build an archer here, too. Let's slam out a couple of guys. Zath is destroying us in science. I don't even know what he's doing that's destroying us in science, but it's a little irritating right now. Like, he's destroying Korea in science. Go figure that one out.
<sighs> ah, yes. That surprises me, Flaming. It's super easy to get good science with Korea. All you have to do is, is look for the right tiles to build the sea ones, right? Sea ones have to go on hills and you don't, they cannot be adjacent to it. Well, okay, they can be. You don't want them to be adjacent to another district. Um, can they be? They can be, but you don't want it. It's suboptimal. So you want them off by themselves on a hill tile somewhere. That's pretty much, if you can if you can build enough cities and crank out enough sea ones, it's, it's I won't say it's easy. I'll say it's, um, doable <laughs> to get a fair amount of of um, of uh, good science production out of Korea. All right. I hate everything he's doing right here. Um, we need machinery now. Ooh, great general. Yes, please. That's going to be solid. All right. Dortmund, what are we doing? We did a builder. We're going to put in some some fishing boats. Uh, I need the granary now. Thank you. I'll go into divine right. It's kind of a waste, but I'll go do it. At least gets me to monarchy. Let's pick up one guy in Venice. That gets me one for free. I'll get rid of that policy card now. Uh, what other cards do we want to change? Anything, anything, anything fewer, fewer. I'm getting rid of the barbarian card now. Um, I think we want to go, do I want to go cheaper upgrades? No, I think I want to do um, 50% bonus here. I want feudal contract. That's the way to go there, I think. Yes. Yep. That'll do for now. I'm not going to have a ton of unit upgrades. It's just not going to be a huge thing for me. All right. We got a settler here. Where are we going? Okay. You're the one going up north. That's perfectly good. That's what we want. Mercenaries. Plus one for the general. Go us. Okay. You know, DJ, there's some action, there's some fun tier three boats. You you, you could 100% convince me to do that. Not a lot, but some. Ooh, if I levy Mexico's military, this could be really, really good for me. Okay, so this is literally just another God only knows what. All right, well, see if they'll let me out. Uh, time for university in Madgeburg, I think. All right, temple's gone in. Time for an apostle. Let's finish that up. We're close to being able to levy the military. Tier two? Yikes. Why do you hate me so much? I don't understand. 
I don't understand. Why does he hate me, chat? Why does DJ hate me, chat? Mikasa. God. Mikasa is legit one of the worst boats. Oh, so painful to play that ship. So bloody painful to play that ship. This city will be okay once I can expand into this river, into this valley. On its own, it's going to suck. It's going to need a lot of help. It occurs to me I can build two national parks down here if I do this correctly. Let me add another marker. Just dawned on me I could do that. Because these tiles will all be considered charming. Interesting. I'm the first one to have met Hong Kong. Ah. Now, isn't Hong Kong's bonus pretty good? Hong Kong's bonus is not bad, kids. All right, let's evangelize. Uh, apprenticeship. Yes, please. Please and thank you. And then now I'm pretty sure we're going to go for Cathedral. Yeah, it's time to go for Cathedral here. And then I need to start building theater districts. Hardcore. Theater districts everywhere. Playing Ludwig like this is, ch is so weird for Germany. I'm just not used to it. It's really messing with my brain. Like, I'm used to Germany, you know, cash production, cash production. Ludwig is like, you want you want the, 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 the culture bonuses, right? Now, he's getting... Um, right, so the Wonders are getting a culture bonus anyway. Um, have I discovered castles yet? I think, yeah, okay, I'm working up to it. I could discover castles and kick that off. Um... Adopt a government with six policy cards. I don't have that yet. I'm going to have that next turn, it looks like. I want to hold the Quadrine back. I don't want him to know the Quadrine is here yet. I'll come through and do a wave of upgrades later. All right, I've overtaken him on military score. That's good. Uh, machinery, somebody... Oh, Sith built Oracle. Yeah, somebody beat me to it. That's all right. I'll find something to put down there. I mean, Kashi does me nothing. That's not going to do me any good. Um... I'll figure something out. I may adjust. This is going to have to get adjusted somehow because Oracle's, Oracle's out of the picture now. All right. We need to do some choppinating. We're going to start out here. Spent cash. What did I spend cash on? Damn it. I don't know. I set myself back. Good evening, Alu. How you doing? Uh, do that. Yeah, that's. I knew. I, I knew there was something I'd done stupid. I was trying to save up cash, but it's my own fault. All right, kill you with the quadrant. That'll come later. Four trade routes is a ways off. Two markets is probably still a bit off as well, although I do need to go ahead and get a commercial hub put right here. Ohm, give me a trader, please. Thank you. 
All right, I think we're gonna go to Monarchy. I don't like it, but it, it's the best. It's I, it's something, right? It gets me, it gets me out of one policy card per type here. Uh, the Great Rider points would be good. I'm gonna pick those up just to get that started, and then I get another military one. I probably want to do the gold discount on upgrades so I can turn everything into crossbowmen. Thank you, Flaming. Kitten, I don't know what it is about Farceless, but it's sexy. Do you have like a natural wonder over there or something? I don't think so. Weird, because, like, the, there's just tons of gold anytime I go to trade with it. Not complaining by any means. All right, I need to send a trader to... I need to send my next two traders to Cologne and run them to Rome, towards Rome, to get a, a road moving this way. And then probably one to Dortmund and trade with, like, Frankfurt or some crap so I can get a road through here. I need to be looking for another... This is probably not a bad city spot right here either. Or maybe even here. One of these two might not be terrible. Check the cost of levy. Oh, no, were you telling me it changes? It probably does with my luck. 312. Okay. Okay, so it keeps going up. Yay. <laughs> All right. I'll keep working on it. I actually have... I obviously... I have a long way to go. All right, uh, let's take my missionary to here. Based on their troops. Okay, so as he's... Oh, I see now. Yeah, he's got man-at-arms now and at least one catapult. And I'm missing the other catapult. He had two earlier. I don't know where they went, but the man-at-arms are pretty amazing. I love all of that. All right, let's chop this out. All right, we've already got a cathedral in the queue. That'll be the next thing we chop out, and then let's go ahead and get our campus cooking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hakuna, your tatas. We're working on it, kids. Hakuna, your tatas. All right. This holy site's district gains faith adjacent moon fried science. Oh, that's sexy. I know where you're going. I only got one holy site, but it'll still be a good one. All right, you're done there. Let's move in here. That tile's going to become mine soon. This feels like it's taking too long, but I've got to slowly build up enough cash to pull this off. Um, Harbor, please, I think. Yeah, why don't you... Come on. Harbor, please, I think. Thank you. Oh, I need Venice. Venice is choking me out here to where I can't move units into this bloody ocean. Oh, Venice, you're so stupid. Why, you're, why are you so stupid? I really, really, really want to wipe this out. Oh, man. It's a, oh, yeah. Um, come down here. I'll hook you up with the swordsman, promote him to man-at-arms or something, and then we'll start moving. Well, you're not wrong, Alu.
I've got a million places I can probably put Potala Palace. It's just a question of finding a good spot. Not really a bad spot, truthfully. I had spies and I could start subverting this city, I would do it, but I don't, so I can't, which is very irritating. All right, let's start cleaning some of this mess up. All right, you're going to here. Let's make it happen. All right, you are going to here. Chill there. Still don't have enough cash, but we're close. Uh, we'll do stirrups. I'm going to promote. No, 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 no. If I spend the cash, I won't be able to levy. Don't promote him yet. However, get them linked and start him south. Choose civic. Civic, 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 civic. Four trade routes, please. That's fine. That's fine. I just need there not be a unit here. Just don't be a unit there on my turn. He, they can't manage it. All right, Mosley, Michel, Chichen Itza, I really don't care. Kilra's actually not a bad one for me. Um, Colossus would be wonderful. Let me put the harbor down. And then I can eventually get a Colossus in. We'll put a, do harbor into builder. And go from there. Uh, and let's do walls and monument right behind, because this will be fairly quick. All right, Ohm, what are we doing here? Harbor as well, I think. Let's get the cash going. More cash is good. Cash is king. Cash is amazing and flexible. All right. No. 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 So then. Land acquisition. Harbor Master. You're in Dortmund. Harbor Master would be good. Um, Cologne, Cologne. That's not bad either. Gain faith when finishing millions. That's not bad. Plus one science. That would be really good. We're doing this right now. I'm sending him to Madgeburg. think we're gonna start with researcher yeah okay hold on let me let me, let me move him around that will help my science uh, uh should help my science quite a bit banking castles finished This must be Rome in here, and I just never actually have seen it. So we're all kind of jammed in here, aren't we, kids? Hundred percent, Alu. Hundred percent. I natter to myself all the time. Sometimes you need expert advice. It's just the way it is. Sometimes you need expert advice. Vices is so cute. He hasn't been, he hadn't even built walls yet. Oh. Oh, is it time? It might be time. It's time, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. Cathedral's in. Library is in.
It's all right. Enjoy your enjoy your enjoy your victory while you have it. We need to trade with Ostia, I think. Uh, the media loan is more money. Money is good. We need money. I literally just went broke. Finally. If I give him too much warning, he'll just have plenty of time to build a, to build walls and crap. What I need to do is get at least a couple of units in position. I'm going to use the chariot to, to guard the flank while I bring in at least, well, hopefully both of the catapults, but we'll see where it goes. Yeah, Lou, it really does. It's difficult. Now, I will say this, right? When I'm when it's just me in the room, and uh, actually when we're both here, sometimes I don't talk to myself. But like, what I do when I stream is I try to give you guys like I my internal monologue. I just say it aloud rather than just like look pensively and you guys. Hey, I wonder what he's thinking right now. I just share, right? Dangerous, perhaps, but that's what I do. Adeldrell, hundred percent. Very good. Good in a different way. Um, a, a very different way to Bandit Brothers, in my opinion. But still good. Pisces can see what's coming now. He knows this is about to happen. Um. How much? Okay, I'm going to need a lot more money to start upgrading units, but we'll figure it out. It does, DJ. I, when, I, when it's just me, I don't, I, you don't usually share that, right? I think next turn is the round I can I can start in here. We'll see how it goes. But I think that's the right play. What's the range on a quad dream? Okay, so he has to be literally like right next door. Okay, we'll figure it out. I think I think I might wait one turn, maybe two, but beyond that, we're gonna be probably going right on in. Um, let's do another missionary. I think. No, let's go ahead and buy the cathedral and be done with it. Then we'll do a missionary. Ooh, governor promotion. Um, Dortmund. Tiles of days and improved features. Both of these are really good for this city. Um, there we go. Extra food on the revealed resources. Choose civic. We want exploration, please. Yeah, I think I'll go in on him next turn. Now, do I have to denounce him? Probably should have done that like seven turns ago. Because I still can't declare war on him. Yeah, I have to wait five more turns. Well, it is what it is. He can see it coming. I don't really care. Let's see what he can do about it. Because he's got this, this city is really hung out to dry.
That at least give me time to get most of this stuff into position. That's something, I suppose. I'm not sure I follow there, uh, Alti. Apologies, I'm just not sure I follow the question. Uh, I got a harbor in yet? No, I think it's time. Let me do a market. I mean, no, let me just do the harbor. Get the harbor in while we're getting the, the build bonuses on harbor. Then give me the market. Cash, 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 cash. Let's start the let's start the crossbowman upgrade program. Three envoys. Uh, let's pick up Hong Kong. And what's it? What's it? There we go. Damn, Raptor, you really like city-states. Well, I'm sort of surrounded here, so I'm doing what I can. <laughs> I see that. Just kind of, I look at the I look at the city state and you're like suzerain of four? Like wow. I just I literally just picked up two more because I had extra envoys laying around. It was like they're not doing me any good if I don't use them, so screw it. True. True. All right. Um let's get over to here. Do a water mill, please. You know what I'm probably going to be having to do? I've got it backwards, guys. I've got it backwards. Don't build the city here. Build the canal here. Build the city here. That's how you do it. That's how you do it. That's how I make it work. That's how I link up. And then I just come out here and I can conquer Venice. One, two, three. That's a legal build. Venice is three tile, four tiles away. And then I just come out here and I conquer Venice and be done with it. I take those points away from Kitten. I conquer Venice. And then now I have complete access to whatever this is from my little inner sea area here. That's what I got to do. But that city's in my way to do it. Is it really, DJ? God, that would piss me off. It probably is the way this stinking map is designed. I'm going to go ahead and get him over the river. I'm going to bring this guy down to the river. Okay. Yep. Good to go there. I don't know, Night Owl. It certainly feels like it was, and I'm I am mightily confused by it, let me tell you. I should probably build a city on this little island too. Wouldn't be too hard if I built something kind of on the like right in here maybe I don't have to think about it probably not a bad I probably not a bad call though I lose a little bit of gold by moving the harbor away from the city center but I think getting a canal makes it makes it worth it it does mean that I might ought to consider something a little different now that I look at it too. Um, maybe do...
something crazy like that. I mean, that's still a plus 10 Hansa. And then move the harbor north of Hex. Do the harbor here. That's not bad either. I'm getting canal, dam, aqueduct. I mean, I'm surrounding this Hansa with all the good bonuses that I can get, right? That's not bad. Him taking my um, fishing boats kind of pisses me off. So we're just going to go take his whole bloody city. <laughs> it's freaking ridiculous. Always waiting on Zath. Always waiting on Zath. I didn't even know that city state existed, and I just completed a quest for them. Go figure. Sure. Let's get everybody, get everybody across the river. That'll help quite a bit. He can see me coming. Two turns still. Fine. What was that? No, 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 no. Oh, for God's sake. No, not yet. I gotta wait two more turns, DJ, but it's coming. It'll happen soon. University in Frankfurt. Kick the science up a notch. Ooh, it's Hansa time. We, we've unlocked Hansa's now, baby. Let's do it. Hansa here, please. Uh, Hansa here, please. Um, Hansa here, please. Uh, Hansa here, please. Now, what was I building before, you dummy? No, oh, oh, sorry, you were actually in between, weren't you? Go granary into Hansa, that's fine. Get your butt up here. Get that done. All right, what am I doing with you? Um, you are coming to do something. Um, let's go make a quarry, I guess. Oh, yay, 30 faith. I wouldn't want to miss out on that. That is an earth-shatteringly good deal right there, kids. If I do this right, I will be able to connect all of these lakes together with the German Navy. So that might have some benefit. Uh, hadn't thought about that. The aqueducts... Yeah, I gotta think about that. I can think about where they go. Okay, I think I'm still one turn away from this. Yeah, next turn I gotta... I, I can't do it till next turn. Uh, we'll go and do naval traditions. Fine. New government. Districts. Cash. Sure. That works. Um, okay, so then... I think we want to do Scions. Uh, I think we want to do uh, Cash. And I think we want to do Merchant and Scientist rather than uh, Writer. Yeah, let's try that.
I can do it this turn, but I have to own the tile. So we'll buy the tile, and we'll buy the upgrade. And we'll link him, link him back up. Oops, I somehow completely tabbed off of my game. There we go. You're good, chill there for a bit. You're good, chill there for a bit. Okay. Artemis would have been nice, but I didn't really have a good spot for it. Quarry, please. I don't really know what to do with you. Just come this way, I guess. There we go. Yeah, it's a good point, Chinko. I gotta look at that. Um, so then, you're probably right. I wanna do, hang on a minute. We wanna go ahead and put the aqueducts in. Probably do it that way. It's not gonna let me do that. Probably, we'll see how it goes. Um, I've already started the one in Berlin, so it's done now. Um, that'll be good. I want to get that. I want to get that one done. Um, I need to be putting in. I haven't even thought about where to put a Hansa in Magburg. However, I do need. I do want the harbor. Actually, no. Skip the harbor right now. You know what I need? I need a. Uh, is there a wonder I can build over here? Huey. Oh, that's a terrible place for Huey. Statue of Zeus. That's kind of garbage. Chichnitz is also kind of trash. Um, build me a knight. That's fine. Begin voting. Or siege? I think I. Oh, let's do siege. Duplicates of chosen luxury. Um, spices for me is probably the best bet. And then I sort of don't care here. I'll vote for Zath. No. Yeah, I'll vote for Zath. One vote for Zath. Congratulations. There we go. Let's see, what do we get, boys? <clears throat> Siege units, spices, and Sith kitten. <laughs> Seth and I voted for each other. <laughs> really? Uh, yeah, I voted for you for the diplomatic points. <laughs> oh my god, and I voted for and you, you voted for me. you were gonna... <laughs> I figured yeah, you guys. would vote for yourself. That is hilariously funny. <laughs> And then Kitten gets it. <laughs> well, of course she does. Wow. All right, enough screwing around. <laughs> Why are we buffing siege units? And it's not going to let me. It's not going to let he's me. He's encroaching on my, my borders. Oh, well, that's a good sign. So now, now I can't. Now I literally can't declare war. It won't let me. I have a feeling I know why, and I assure you there are easier ways to come across that particular mineral. Actually, no. <laughs> that has nothing to do with it. He just needs Lebensraum. All right. Now we finally did it. Let's go, baby. He's going to heal that, but I'm going to have a lot more siege for him next turn. So it should be fun times. All right. What do we got? Metal casting. Ooh, bombards. That could be fun. Uh, yeah, 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 Patala. Patala would be good. I'll see if I can pull it off. 
All right. Um, monument, I guess. No, give me a lighthouse first. That's fine. It's not even my catapult. <laughs> I bought it off of somebody. <laughs> wait a minute. Wait a minute. Raptor declared war on Vices and Kitten declared war on Raptor? Is that, did I read that right? She was probably in an alliance or something. It's fine. Yeah. Indeed. That's fine. Uh huh. Okay. I don't even know. I've barely found her borders, so I'm not super concerned. I was waiting on you, buddy. Bring it. <laughs> I only need the one city, man. I need you out of my way. Actually, I don't even look. Do I have Niter anywhere else? Yeah, I'll have some up by Berlin. Yeah, I'll have at least that source of Niter. And I'll be able to get a hold of this one. So yeah, it's fine. All right. All right, I can definitely start to see Kitten's borders now, but I have no idea what she's doing inside of them. Something tells me you might find out. <laughs> That's true. Multiplay millennia. I'm not sure what you mean there, Reggie. What is that? What is millennia? Now, he didn't build... He doesn't have walls. He has no walls. I just have to... I have to do enough damage to the city here. <clears throat> I'll do so much more with this valley than he ever could. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm such a jerk. <laughs> Ooh, it occurs to me I should move this thing. Hold on a minute. Uh, yeah, and let's slide you down some so that you can actually see what's going on. There we go. About like that. That ought to be better. Now it's not covering up all the info. Forex game like Civ that releases tomorrow. Okay, I'll have to check it out. Reggie, I've never heard of it until you just mentioned it. So uh, I will have to go do some research and see what I can learn. Okay, much better. There we go. I'm done. Now we can make peace. But I mean, if you want to keep fighting, we can, sir. I just don't think that's going to work out for you. All right, finally. 30-minute warning, man. Where does the time go? I know, right? Seriously. All right. Uh, let's just get a granary in so I can do my things. He literally can't expand his borders any farther south than this, so this is almost perfect for me. I just have to get this settler in here and build, and I'm in great shape. And then we'll keep moving east, and we'll conquer Venice along the way. Mallet, welcome in, my friend. How are you doing? Ladies and gentlemen on YouTube. Ladies and gentlemen of YouTube, you need to make sure you hang out and follow Mr. Mallet. 
If you enjoy wood carvings, woodworks, and so on, you guys can't tell. Hang on a minute. This right here that's all blurry is a beautiful laser etching of USS Fletcher that my wife ordered for me that Mallet made, and it proudly hangs on the wall in my study here. So if you guys um, if you guys haven't followed him or haven't checked him out, you absolutely should. Okay. Now, all I have to do is sit on this side of the river. I'm going to hold you back in friendly territory. If you guys have any kind of that kind of sort of that kind of fun custom woodworking stuff you need, you go right ahead and, and contact him. He's going to set you up. I have produced a great work. Okay. I, I don't know how I did that, but okay. I don't know how. I've discovered astronomy, discovered naval tradition. Oh, it came out of the, the goody hut. Okay, very nice. That's actually kind of cool. There's actually some really good terrain up here that Zath could be sitting on, but he isn't. Promotion available. Uh, let's do hills. All right. Uh, humanism? Humanism. Civ is so good. It remains so good. Such a great game. All right. Hansa gets me a golden age next time, which we needed. That's good to see. Let's get a lighthouse put down in Munich and a workshop to go in the Hansa, please. In the reverse order. There we go. All right. Where could I put a government plaza? Now, this might not be a bad spot. Let's think about this for a minute. Where should I put this thing? The fact that I don't have one kind of makes me sad. I really should have one. Um, Berlin Sans is finished. Give me a workshop, then some walls, please. Um, market in Madge. We need the cash. Oh, well, we're back to 300 gold already. Now, now the cash is coming in. Now the cash is coming in. All right, 15 production on wonders, on settlers. I'm kind of I'm kind of leaning more towards wonders right now. I really think I need to go back and take stock of some of the wonders that I've missed and maybe grab them. Um I definitely have got to start focusing some on theater districts. Like 100% it's kind of sad that I haven't. It's actually genuinely sad that I haven't. I sort of suck at this. Um, I'm getting good culture out of the wonders. And I'm starting to get tourism out of the wonders. But not a lot. I'm a long way from a tourism victory, right? Man, it's not going to let me put a canal here because the niter is there. Oh, so, so irritating. Actually, I might be able to build it here. No, because that's hills. I don't think there's a way to pull this off the way I wanted. Oh, stupid niter. Stupid niter, man. Oh, hold on a minute. I can pillage this? Oh, there's a road here. No, I don't want to pillage the road. Leave the road, thanks. Oh, I'm at war with Venice. Oh, hey, I can attack his his crap. Um, okay, let's attack his crap, I, I guess. Um, I hadn't realized that was a thing, but apparently that's a thing. Okay, let's back you off to here and back you off to here. I think I'm still going to build this city here because it's legitimately at a, such an amazing spot for me. I'd be a fool not to. Like, I, it's going to be such a... I mean, I'm going to get tea and all the rest of this crap out of it. Like, I'd have to be some kind of just absolute idiot not to build there. But the one thing that I really wanted, I'm not going to get to do because I can't build a canal here either, can I? Hills. It's not going to be able to canal there either. 
If I could build the canal here, I could do like a little jig jig jag thing through. But no, it's not going to let me do that. Um, yeah, there's 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 no way to pull this off now. Not the way I wanted. I could theoretically put. I think you. I think Panama doesn't have the same restrictions. Panama must be built on flat land where there are two adjacent tiles directly across the middle of the following criteria. One tile must be illegal to hold the canal. Yeah. So even, even Panama Canal cannot be built on hills, which makes no sense. Which makes no sense. It makes no sense. Literally, Panama Canal was cut through the hills. Why can't I build it on hills? That's so dumb. All right, let's get this. Oh, I have to buy my tile back. That's the president, stupid son of a... Okay. I'm still going to I'm still going to build this city and I'll try and figure out the canal thing later. At a minimum, maybe I'll end up building the harbor right here. That way I have boat access the other way, right? I'm going to delete this harbor tile right now and just go from there. Um and actually what I think I'm going to end up doing now is putting is putting the Hansa back where it was. You're crazy, son. Mr. October with the resub, welcome in. Thank you so much. I think that's the play. I think the play is to put the Hansa back where it was. Like so. That's still a plus 10 Hansa. Oh, no, not you. Damn. 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 That's still a plus 10 Hansa. There is absolutely nothing to sneeze at there. Like, that is still an excellent Hansa, and then I just lose the canal. That's fine. Like, that is not bad. I know, right, Night Owl? That's why it legitimately doesn't make any sense to me that you can't do it. But here we are. Okay, you stay here. I need to start upgrading my military. Um, I want you to come through... Really? Okay. Okay. I don't know why, but okay. He's losing... Ooh, he's losing loyalty in Busan. That could be fun. Now I want to build monuments around him. <laughs> exactly my point, Night Owl. Like, it doesn't make any sense that that, that one you can't do that to, right? It just doesn't... It does not... It does not compute with me that you can't... That's the... Of all the ones... If the regular canal couldn't do it, that sort of makes sense, right? Traditional canals as they were built in like, you know, what, the 15th and 16th centuries, they really struggled, right, without high explosives to cut them through rough spots. It was They, they could dig ditches. That's all a canal really was in that era. It was a big-ass ditch, right? But what really drove and allowed Panama Canal? TNT, dynamite, right? Like these kinds of things are what allowed for it. Um, let's put the monument in, and then let's put a harbor in. Actually, no, let's put in the commercial hub next. There we go. I'll put the harbor in after. No, I should put the harbor in first. The harbor will help feed me. The harbor will help feed me. Put the harbor in first. There we go. Monument into harbor. That makes more sense. It probably is, DJ. It probably is, with my luck. But I am 100% going to push through and conquer Venice. It's absolutely going to happen. Now, this could be interesting. I'm not going to buy that tile because conquering Venice will not be hard when the time comes. I'm going to go ahead and get some walls put in. And I need to go ahead and buy a builder, I think. It's not going to let me. Oh, because of the because of the general. Okay, pull him out of there then. Come back to here or something. You can chill. Now I can buy the builder. There we go. Okay. And when you're done, let's get that commercial hub put in. Choose research. Cartography, please. 
Claim great person. Sure. What are we doing at home? Bank. Bank is good. Cash is king. Um, workshop, please. Thank you. I should be sending out more missionaries. I have all this faith and nothing to spend it on right now. Wrong city. Missionary. Missionary. Now, who else has founded a religion? Nobody. Just me and Kitten. How curious. Gain 100 gold in an envoy. Sure. Well, as soon as I can end this war, I will. I got exactly what I wanted, but it's not going to let me end it anytime soon, right? I have to wait. I have to wait a few more turns. It's fine. I'm not fussed. I got what I needed. All right, let's send the, let's start let's keep sending these guys out. So how's the war going? I'm good. I got done what I needed to get done. Oh. The problem is I think it just connects to another damn inland sea the way this map is designed. Roll, roll. Eh, typical. Oh, what you raised is what you got, buddy. All that you got left down there is tundra. Well, that's fine. I mean, that... That river valley, I had laid that out, and I had, a, I had a settler going over there, and then you came down with one, and I was like, that kind of irritates me, because that's a plus 10 Hansa that I had laid out. I don't like that. <laughs> so Funny. Funny, because I had you please one leave. right where I had attack. Because you what? I said, it's funny. I had one right where I put one right where I had attack. Right, and I had one about two squares north. Actually, okay. something like that. It was close. The river valley is more valuable for me than the than the tundra. Where am I? Madgeburg. Uh armory? Armory, please. Thank you. Uh do I want I think that has some value eventually. I'm gonna put one there. I'm a little irritated Zath did this. Yeah, I like I've been liking that culture bonus. Thanks. That's been pretty solid. The problem is, is that I had plans to put a canal there, and now I can't because the game spawned Niter on that hex. So I'm quite irritated. Oof. Yeah. Like, I don't even need the stuff. I'd dig it up and throw it out if I could, but it's not going to let me. Wouldn't that be kind of nice, right? Like, well, this is not here for me. Right, like, I don't, I don't need it, but it's, it's there, and I can't get rid of it. So, yay. All right, well, there's my Niter mine. I suppose that's something. Um, let's buy this food tile, please. And that food tile. 15-minute warning, y'all. Yeah, baby. Can I, Ching? Where? Right through here? Raptor has been spending his uh, envoys. It's, it's telling me that I can't do it through hills. The game says that I can't do it through hills. What am I missing? The other side. On this one hex? Oh, what, you mean, you mean like here? I could put it through here? Like these two tiles. Nah, I don't wanna do that. Nah, I don't wanna do that. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Gunpowder, please. Yes, thank you. Um. I need to be building more wonders. Why am I not building more wonders? I suck at wonder building. Uh, we're going to build Colossus. Yes, we are. We are 100% going to build Colossus. Which I I've, has always been one of my favorite wonders. Um, what else have we got cooking? There we go. There we go. Finally got that city converted. Now, have I converted Zath yet? I have not. I don't know how I haven't converted Zath yet. Okay, You're chilling there for a bit. Come back up in here. I am uh, 
being advised to send hellos from KGB Terminator for my stream. Outstanding. Hi, Terminator. Oh, yeah, that's fine. You know, Terminator, you could always she, come to our channel. She can bombard it, and then I'll go, okay, and then life goes on. It's not that big a deal. I can always just buy a... a I can probably buy a... Um, um, crossbowman in here with enough cash and then just and just 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 kind of shrug it off. It's not that big a deal. Uh, I do need some more crossbowmen though. So let's go back to Madgeburg and put some more in the queue, huh? Ooh, no trader. Yeah, I'm down a trade route. Let's get that done. All of these bloody inland seas, man. So irritating. You're fine. Just chill. <laughs> Hold on. I will happily condemn the heretic. I'm going to lose my scout, but I sort of don't care. The one I took from Korea... Oh, she's, oh, she's, yeah, she's shooting it with an archer. It's, it's going to heal that up every round. That's not even, that's not even really a threat. I could probably conquer this from him if I really wanted, but I just don't care. It's not, it's not important. That's fine. I could at least cost him some military units. That's something. We'll beat up on Venice a little bit. It makes us it makes us feel better. Uh I can now buy a crossbowman here. I will shoot her archers down shortly. Do 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 and then we st I still need yeah, build okay, that's going. Yep. Yep. Colossus in the ground. Yep. Uh, I think it's like seven or eight. Oh, I can make peace now. That's fine. I'll even, I'll even send him. Oh, I can't send him cash. I'll tell you what I will do. I will send him some goodies because I'm, I'm a nice dude. We'll see if he takes it. If he doesn't, he doesn't. That's fine. I don't care. I got what I needed. If he wants to keep fighting, we'll figure it out. Um, I think I'm going to stick with Merchant Republic right now, Gen uh, honestly. I think... Theocracy doesn't feel amazing, although I could be buying... St I should be spending more of my faith on builders. Where is my Magberg? Yes. Oh my god, I am so stupid. Yes, I need to be buying... Wait, no, not Pingal. Where's her? Builder. Bam. Okay. So. <laughs> they clearly didn't talk beforehand. Pisces told me to go pound sand and Kitten said okay. <laughs> That's really funny. <laughs> All right. That's fine. Pisces can tell me to pound sand. Um. He may not like what happens here if he continues that road, though, so we'll see how this goes. I forget how much longer I have these units levied for. It's not long. Uh, I forget. I have to look. But it's not many. Uh, camp, please. Thank you. <laughs> I will also condemn the heretic. <laughs> it does make sense. I'm just surprised that she would kind of turn it, turn her back on her ally like that. That's all. It amuses me a little bit because it feels it feels it feels wrong, right? 
I mean, he's already at war with Mexico City. And I just lost control of those units. So now they're basically going to just walk right up Ten to his front door morning. and start smashing him in the face. I thought about upgrading the chariot to a knight, but I didn't just in case he bought the, he bought the city off. I didn't want to have to deal with it. All right. Aqueduct is done. Hansa is done. Uh, workshop into armory into bank and then let's let's start looking at wonders what wonders can i put here oh oh i've got a lot lots of good options here uh forbidden city oh yes please oh yes please i could do forbidden city this could be potala but then I have nowhere to put the adjacent. Uh, here. What do you guys think? Should we um, stop save at the start of the next turn and then chat? Is it time? Yeah, we probably should. I mean, I have a feeling like there's a lot to talk about. In the words of Intergalactic I, Lover I, Boy, we have much to discuss. I can't put Potala here. St. Basil's does me no good. Chichen Itza does me no good. Oh, somebody beat me Colossus. Son of a biscuit eater. Pyramids, Library, and Colossus all in one turn. Yep, I'm losing out now. Okay, I got to get back on the Wonder Game. Got to get back on the Wonder Game. I think I do want to go ahead and build Kilwa. I need to find... Where can I... Must be building a flat tile addition to coast. I need to find another place to build Kilwa, but I don't really have a good one, maybe? Ugh. Uh, what else can I build? Apadon? No. Torbellum is Torbellum is actually pretty solid. Let's do Torbellum. That's fine. Get that going. I would also still like to build Forbidden City. Um, I could build Patala. That actually wouldn't be a bad spot for Patala right there. What are my other options over here? I think we're going to need longer turns soon. Aww. Well, I'm just saying, I'm I'm having to do a lot of looking around, and I'm struggling with the timing. I mean, I kind of am, too. So maybe we think about that for next week. For next week. week. Yeah, yeah. We don't have to do it right now, obviously. But thinking for next week. Okay. Uh, I'll have to make a dedication. Yikes. Uh, what am I doing? No. Yes. Traders can't be plundered sounds pretty good. Uh, monumentality. I'm kind of rushed into this, but I feel like it's the right play. All right, shall we pause and save now? Probably. All right, let's do it. So... Um, let's start with, uh, with Vices, since you have the lowest score. How, uh, how did today go for you? Eh, about as expected. Would you care to expand on that, sir? I got several cities laid out. Um, I'm still finding difficulty pivoting from expansion into military. And, uh, due to that, I lost my southern colony, so... As a yeah, I see you currently have the lowest um, uh, military score. Ironically, your science is also lagging behind, too, and you're a science civ. Indeed. Okay, so I'm just looking for talking points. I'm not trying to, like, oh, no. you know. Uh, it, it's because I had to pivot to military much earlier than I wanted to. Um, because your score and uh, Raptor's score was growing, so I knew one of you two were going to attack. And okay. So I, I couldn't exactly focus on science anymore. I had to focus on military, and the attack came before I could do that. So. Got it. Okay. So Raptor attacked you before you were prepared, essentially. As is, okay. yeah, but... It's okay. You stay tuned for next week. There's no need to put it all out there, you know? <laughs> oh, there's not much more, but it's just now it's time to recover and try and at least get 
a higher score. Fair enough. Okay. Kitten, how about you? How were things tonight? I mean, tonight was okay. I'm just kind of trying to get everything set now. I think I've got my cities where I want them. And I'm, my religion is spreading like wildfire. So I'm kind of just going okay. from there. So one question I have, because I, I, I know your territory yeah, you more so than I know uh, Vices. Why haven't you expanded northeast of Athens and Miletos? Because a lot of that area is going to end up flooding really fast. Really? It's all floodwater area. It's all floodplain. Oh, there's a lot of floodplains. See, so I've learned, Raptor, you probably have too, right? That you can put dams on floodplains and then when you tie that in with aqueducts you get really sexy looking industrial zones right yeah um i think it's uh, it's not just the hansa that gets that benefit right like all all industrial zones Everybody. get the benefit from aqueduct canal and all that stuff right yes correct yes. yeah that's what i thought so it, the trick is, it takes time that to build well up to that. Yeah, it does take time to get to that. That is true. But I'm, you know, I see some really good city locations up there, Kitten. And I got to say, like, you were talking about being blocked off from expansion before. Seriously, go up there. I mean, Athens is your capital, isn't it? No. No? Sparta is. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, hey, because she's, she's right, Gorgo. you're playing Gorgo. She's Gorgo. Right. I, I forgot. But yep. still, I would... I would totally expand up there. I mean, it's it's pristine land, in my opinion. We'll see how it goes. I mean, this, the stuff that I've spotted up there looks pretty good. I'm kind of jealous it's not closer to me. So, yeah, I'd go get it. Right? Absolutely. I mean, that's... You've got room for at least three, maybe four good cities. I say, if you there. don't go get it, Zas going to send something across the sea, and he's going to no. take it. No. no. I mean, oh, okay. I've got ten cities, but I'll keep going. Why not? <laughs> I um, I'm trying really hard to fight the urge to just expand like a virus. So for me, you know, I'm just I'm taking over areas, and then I, I'm I'm happy, frankly. And if that means we lose the game because of it, I don't care. I, I'm just sick of trying to manage everything. You know. I hear you. Well, Raptor, you're next on the score list. So, um, how was tonight? Uh, it wasn't bad. I, I, I had to do something I didn't want to do, which was which was attack Vices to get that Aww. last to get that last city spot that I had kind of picked out that I really liked. Um, which city spot is that? Uh, it's to his south near Venice. If you can see that on your map, uh, yeah, you had a Dorman? legion down here a little while ago. Oh no, I see it. I see it. Um, yeah. Trier. Yeah, that's that's I I originally wanted to build one hex to the left of uh, the left of that and put a canal through. And then mm. but but Trier is on a hills tile. You can't do that. And then I was like, oh wait, wait, if I put the city there and then put the canal on the other hex, that's legal. And then literally mm. the turn that I was that I was starting in on my attack, I the I rolled over and discovered gunpowder and there's niter on that tile. And it was like, well, you son of a bitch. Well, Whatever. Yep. Now, I did something I also have never done before. Well, incredibly rarely, anyway. I levied New Mexico. I levied the military of Mexico City to make that attack mm. possible. I would never have been able to do it otherwise, because he okay. had okay. he had two catapults, two man at arms, and a, a, a chariot. And it was like they were already in position. All I had to do was like levy them, walk down there, use them, and then they literally just reverted back to him. I think last turn. So. That worked out really well. I've, I don't usually use city states that way, especially as Germany. I'm usually busy conquering them, right? So right, but it, it's kind of fun, especially if it's a city state that's at war with you, to then change them and then buy their military. Be right. like, you fight for me now. Right. You know? Well, like, it, it, they weren't at war with me, but it was like this: these units are what's going to allow me to make this attack happen. And right. so I was talking with my chat, and it was like, look, I'm gonna we'll, we'll do the levy. I had to, I'd forgotten the stupid war mechanics, right? Where I have to denounce and then wait, and then I can declare and all the rest of that stuff. So that was also a lesson for me. I haven't done that in a while. Um, well, 
that's the new rules, right? Oh, no. no surprise it makes, war. It makes total sense. I'm fine with it. I had just forgotten about it, and it was like, oh, right, okay. So I actually lost some time. I levied them too early, basically, right? I should have denounced, waited a couple of rounds, then levied, then attacked, right? And so that was... Okay. That was that was a, a learning experience, you know. Uh, uh, all the all the card games that I play on the tabletop, like sequence of doing things matters. That was one yes. of those examples of wrong sequencing. Didn't wasn't disastrous, but it was it was wrong sequencing. So like something yeah. to be learned there. Yeah, it needs to be higher on the stack. Yeah, Absolutely. exactly, exactly. Um, other than that, I feel I need to be spending more time focused on wonder building. I just turned around and you guys snatched four wonders from me that round. I only had one of them in production and it was like, well, that's irritating. So I need to be doing a better job. I, I, you know, I'm playing Ludwig. I need to be focused on wonders, culture, great works and religion. And I'm doing okay on the religion thing. The rest I am not. So I need to be doing better. Mm. Yeah, I, frankly, I'm surprised because Ludwig is, it's all about building wonders, but it's not about finishing wonders. It's literally just about starting them, right? Well, yes and no. Like his bonus comes once you own it. Right. right. Um, until but you own you the thing. don't you get the extra culture from building though? I, I you get the culture, get. I think, even while it's incomplete. But the, Right, that's what I mean. But the tourism bonus you get from owning it. And the tourism bonus is how you win the game, right? Right. You don't win the game by having the highest culture total. You win the game by having the most tourism. That's a culture victory. So yep. that's yep. that's the catch, right? So I've built a few that I'm happy with. Obviously, I got Colosseum, which is a nice one. Um, I was in the middle of doing Colossus when I think Kitten grabbed it, which is smart. Me. It's great. You grabbed somebody. It's a great one. I love Colossus. <laughs> I've always loved that one. I love it too. Such I a always, great wonder. It's so it's honestly, it's cheap for what it does, and it's a solid little wonder. Um, and then what else did I grab? I've got one other. I think I've only got two. Oh, I built Stonehenge, right? Just yes. to be a jerk. I'd already started it, and it was like, screw it. It's a wonder. I get I get tourism and everything out of it because I'm, because I'm me. Fine, just do it. And it's cheap. And it was relatively cheap. So, yeah. So, I've, I'm starting to... I've got to, I've got to do a better job of focusing on the wonders and looking for more national parks. I've picked out a couple or three already, but I need to do better with that. And then I was way behind on military. I had almost... I, I didn't even have archers, Zaf. I was just... It was sad. I looked around and went, my what? God. Yeah, I just... I had built almost no military units. So it was like, I okay. Mean, that's one of the reasons my score's gone up is because I looked at my territory and went, I could get like steamrolled. This is not okay. There were times where I looked at the military score, not going to lie, and I'm like, what the hell is everybody doing? Yeah. Because like, I'm not building military, just just founding a Civ. I get that free mil melee unit, right? Right. I'm just like, uh, yep. guys, yep. <laughs> you know, so, this is a peaceful land. I like yep. it. <laughs> so I've got a lot of work still to do. I need to, like, the war with Vices was a one-off. I had no intention of doing that, but it was like, I, I really, really want this city to yeah. kind of round things out. And so I grabbed it and... At this point, I don't think there's any need for me to attack anybody else. I, I certainly don't want to because it's not what... Yes, I'm Germany. I have high production, but it's not what I want to be spending my time doing. It's not my win condition. Right. right. I mean, it could be, but you're right. It, there's it, there's it, better things to it do. It could be, but if I wanted to win be a conquest, I'm playing the wrong German leader, right? So... Yes. And, and frankly, with us playing multiplayer, conquest is harder to just to right. right when you're playing among friends conquest is like the jerk move <laughs> right like oh right. i'm gonna just keep playing until you're all dead well that's not fun for them so like don't do that maybe i don't know right yeah and th so this is my first game where like i've actually you know negotiated with people like okay, okay. i'm gonna build my city here like I oh talked yeah, with yeah you, yeah, you yeah. know I'm going to build my city where I did. You said we we're going to build them. Look, we've, we've got encampment districts. <laughs> exactly. Like, that was always the goal, right? Hi, friend. You know, yeah. Yeah, exactly. And then, you know, same thing on the other side. Like, I was actually planning on building a city past this mountain range. And then Kitten's like, no, I want it. I'm like, all right, fine. Like, you know, I'll, I'll be the oh, nice you're about to the, You're talking about to the west of Kume and Setia? Yes, exactly. Okay. I was going to build one city past that mountain range because that's a really nice, sexy choke point. Mm -hmm. um, and then uh, I mentioned something to Kitten and she said, oh, I got no room to expand. So I'm like, OK, fine, I'll back off. 
A little, if I would have known yeah, this I know. entire landmass to the north is there, I'd been like, yeah, F I, off. I'm I, settling here. I just have discovered, I've got a little, I've got a slinger up there wandering around exploring that going, my God, look at this territory. It's beautiful, right? It's flat. Yeah. It's covered in resources. There's a floodplain here, which would make it for an amazing industrial district right here in the heart of it. You could build a power plant and power every city on this peninsula right here out of this river valley, right? right? Like it right. would be so cool. It's a dream land. It yeah, really it's, is. It's, it's got everything you'd want. It's really laid out nice. And I'm betting, you know, there's there's some desert tiles. I'm betting if you go north, there's some tundra. There's probably some uranium and some oil and some aluminum out there, too, right, when the time comes. So, like, it's prime real estate. It really is. I'm really surprised that she doesn't think it's worthwhile. Yeah, I would, I would 100% walk over and snatch it for sure. Oh, God, yeah, especially when she's complaining about running into, like, you know, well, I guess you and Vices. It looks like she ran into Vices. Yeah, I think she ran into Vices the direction she's going. Um, she had moved some military units over to kind of support him as a part of their alliance, but they were very, very late to arrive, and it, they, they weren't it weren't impactful, so. I mean, it, it happens. Snicker, you're asking the wrong guy, unfortunately. I don't play. I don't play. But, I haven't played um, clan battles in like you know, three years. I've, like I said, I've been focusing on not expanding as much, mm -hmm. and instead just just building up my empire. And right. it's it's been fun to do. Whether it causes a win or a loss, I don't know. But it's been fun to do for a change. And I'm you know? I'm I'm actually starting to wonder as I get deeper into this game if maybe I've sort of taken the wrong tack with Ludwig as well, right? If maybe I shouldn't have stopped expanding about two or three turns ago. Or you know, uh, or you know, whatever. A while, a little while back, and been like, okay, this is good. Nice core of cities, ready to go. Mm -hmm. Let's go. You know, wonder building, right? Like, stop, yep. stop expanding. I've just, I'm, my brain is so trained to look at new terrain that's unsettled and go, that's an amazing city. That's an amazing city. That's an, you know, whatever, and start dropping yep. tacks and pins because I just look at it and my brain automatically goes that direction. And well, I'm yeah. sorry. Go ahead. No, no, I was gonna say, and, and so I'm, I'm not. Uh, you know, trying to untrain my brain for that. I'm not sure I can. I don't know. <laughs> I almost wonder if one of these days we need to do a game that's literally one city challenge. You, have you heard of this before? I've, I've heard of this before. I would almost rather us, uh, you know, take the four of us or something and play on an even smaller map and say, yeah, like four city max, right? Yep. Four city max. Like, that's it. You build four cities. That's all you get. The rest you've got to figure out, right? Or whatever. Conquers. And that would, I would say, I would say, uh, we'd have to have a conversation about conquering city states. I'd be curious to try it, right? I like that idea. I think mm. that that'd be fun to artificially limit city states. But also, I mean, now you're starting to see the, the, the push to a smaller map size, right? right. Like, because it, it's just exhausting constantly expanding out. And it part is. of that is, Part of that, of course, is like you just said, same deal. I'm the same way. I'm like, oh, yeah. look at this land. I, I got to take this land. I know. But the other part of it is that the, the reason this land is here is because other opponents aren't conquering this land and taking it. And it's right. like, OK, at a certain point, you know, it, it, it's nice to be able to grab the land. But at the same time, you know, you're screwing the other person over. Right. So, right. But, well, uh, and this, I this actually hella fun. When Vices moved south Sorry. with that first city, that city that he built near me, I was kind of like, at first I was like, man, that's irritating. But I was like, eh, I'll probably let him out. And then he built, he built a library, <laughs> uh, not a library, of 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 a Siwan, right? And he built it in such a way okay. that he culture bombed a tile that I already owned, like uh. like, like a fishing tile. And I was like, okay, now you've pissed me off, like, <laughs> like. I probably might have let this go, but now you've irritated me. Like, come on. He's playing He's playing from the Lord's F playbook of pissing I, Raptor I, off. I guess, man. And he didn't even do it intentionally, I promise. I know he didn't. That's not how that's not how he plays. But I was just like, oh, come on. This is some BS, right? Like, ugh. You know, I just kind of realized for me. something. I was like, no, nah, I'm getting rid of this. This is the first Monday that I can think of in, in memory where I didn't piss you off about something. Have oh you no, it's, it's, it's happened plenty of times. You haven't always, you don't piss me off every week. Well, I guess, I, it's just like, <laughs> I always no. joke with my chat, I'm like, 
I totally didn't have piss off Raptor on my bingo card tonight, but it happened. I mean, well, um. <laughs> true, but I mean, like, uh, you know, if you think back to the very, very, very first game, it's like a year ago now, mm. right? Like, yeah, you didn't really piss me off in that game. We were we were sort of kind of neighbors and we were playing both of us playing from behind in that particular game. Mm. Um, you was you was Abraham Lincoln and me as the other German leader. Right. And yes, um, we basically were like, OK, just like tonight, it was like, look, I'm going to stop here, you know, do your thing. And then we built our little sections up and, you know, and life went on like that entire game wasn't really much about I wasn't watching you like mass the infant, the little infantry treat like <laughs> didn't piss me off. I just kind of rolled my eyes at like, well, that's some garbage like that shouldn't happen. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. That's exactly right. My chat is like, right, reject humanity, embrace crab. I'm like, say, see, my chat remembers this game, right? Oh, please, see? no. My chat remembers the crab game. So there you go. We all remember the crab game. We don't want to, but we have to. Yep. Yeah, we were all there for it. But it's crazy how far we've come, right? Because like right. you said, you know, to the point where we're like negotiating, we're talking. Okay, I'm going to build right. here. You can build there. It's okay. We're both okay. We're both happy for now. Let's do it, you right. know? Right. Whereas a few, a few months ago. Well few games ago it was like i'm just boom there <laughs> i i i think i i there's a part of me that feels like i pissed vices off tonight like i think i'm the one like he's probably the one pissed at me and i i'd say rightfully so i i knew sure. when i was doing that i was not going to make any friends um but like last turn for example for me i'm done war's over i don't need anything else out of this i sent him and kitten both peace offerings she accepted okay. he didn't which i find curious oh. yeah i found that interesting oh. She kind of left her ally out to dry, hung her ally out to dry a little bit there. So I was like, that surprises yeah. me. I figured they would have talked and said, no, no, turn him down. Okay. It's not how it happened. So we'll see. Um, he may yet decide to build some military and come smash it at me somewhere. And if that's the case, well, then I've earned it. Let's, let's, let's tussle, you know? So I have to stay on my toes now and probably continue building up uh, a little bit of military resources. Well, and I was just going to bring up, this almost seems like a splendid little war for you because you managed to just in a short period of time achieve your objectives right but what do i is go ahead if vices is still upset with you it could be if costly. he's got other plans it could, could be, be costly. could be costly for yeah, you absolutely it could be 100 yes. what do i always say about war zath in this game war is expensive it delays you war well war That's is it. expensive and and the only reason i was able to pull this off was because i saved up enough cash and i levied mexico city I took exactly mm. one of my own military units into this campaign. I raised his city, got it out of my way. I had a settler nearby. I, he's been sitting around for literally like 20 turns. Brought him in, mm. found him my city. Done. Sent him a peace deal as soon as I could. Like, that's all I, I'm done. I, I'm, I'm good. That's all I needed. And yep. is I'm 100% positive. I made no friends doing this. Okay. <laughs> but at the sure. same time, I look at it like, you know, I got what I needed. And he hadn't even, you know, he had been down there long enough. The city had grown to size three. He had, when he started off, when I started moving units in, he had only regular archers. He did upgrade them to crossbowmen. Had not built okay. any walls. And I was kind of, and so I had two catapults and a quad dream. And it was like, I'm just going to bombard you. And, and you know, he wasn't able to defend it. So, I mean, I've been that guy. I, when, right? I, when I saw you go for siege unit power or whatever, right. I, I'm just like, okay. So he's planning a war and he just exactly got that war handed to exactly. him. Exactly. <laughs> like right there. Well, like, and, and my chat goes, it helps your target was on the asset of nowhere with no prospect of reinforcements. Exactly. That was exactly True. one of the reasons that I chose. Like, I would never have attacked his main empire. I don't, there's no point to that, right? Not in this early in the game. I, no. No. But he built, he built like this remote southern city, kind of in an area where I wanted one. I had already been moving units in that direction and it was like, with, with a city-state right there with five military units ready to go, I can borrow those for 15 turns, come in, get this out of my way, build my city, and go back to my game. So um, if I end up paying more for that because I've pissed him off, then that's the – you reap what you sow, right? That's my own fault. I have to figure that out. So, I guess that that's, that's going to become the real challenge for you next week is yeah. how do you repair the relationship with him? Right. If it's if it's even repairable, because it sounds like it's kind of not at least well, right now. We'll see. Like at this point, I'm I'm not in his way anywhere else. Um, he I don't know where else he can grow. Um, I've got a scout that's looking to his north. There might be land over here. It looks like it's to the northwest of Kitten's main, probably her capital, 
right? There's some frozen mm -hmm. tundra up here. There's another city state up here called Akkad. I don't know if you've found Akkad. them yet. Okay. Yep. yep so yep. like up there, I'm not seeing any cities. I mean, is it great terrain? I don't know. I haven't seen much of it yet, but maybe he can no. expand over there if he wanted to. Um, not really. Okay. Well, so we'll see. But the beauty of Korea is Korea can play tall and do just fine. Korea doesn't necessarily need to be huge. Well, and I think this, it, frankly, I think it's a better Civ for Vices mm -hmm. than the Viking he was originally playing as. Yes. I don't remember the name, but, you know. Yeah, um, Because I think it's just play style. He's he's not as much of an expansionist. It may have been Night Owl. He built tall, like you said. And yeah. That, that's what Korea is all about. And so I think he's got a chance to, to really pull this off. I agree. You know, what I think is interesting is all of us are pretty close in score. Mm -hmm. You know, there's nobody that's really, like, you know, just outrunning the competition. I realize I've got the highest score right now, but yeah. that to me doesn't mean jack. Because it doesn't. How many times have I been in second or third and and still done okay for myself? Like it's it exactly. doesn't. Score is not everything. No, it, it never is. Uh, how many times have you played warships? <laughs> you know, uh -huh. score uh -huh. doesn't mean jack. Score don't mean so, nothing, kids. So um, you know, I'm excited to see what happens next week, and yeah. I I just um. Yeah, I mean, this is. I love playing Rome. It's such. It's so fun just building a trade empire. And it's just a very easy sieve to play, and you rake. You rake in money like nobody's business. Yes. And like I was like I was telling my cash earlier tonight, my 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 chat cash is king, right? <laughs> yes. Cash is king in sieve. It's so easy. You know, you, you can rack up a, such a ton of money, and just then you have all kinds of flexibility. I bought a Settler earlier tonight, and I didn't even Night think Owl. about Stay tuned. it. I have a and comment after for I you bought it, that. I'm like, guys, I just spent 700 gold on a Settler. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I honestly, I Zath, care. I was busy kicking myself in the face because that entire era we just finished, I had monumentality and could have been spending my faith to buy Settlers and Builders, and I didn't until like the very end, like a dumbass. Oh, so yeah. So well, now, that, now that's... I have it again, and I'm going to be buying a boatload of Builders because I have a lot of terrain to improve. And that's what happens when you go from one to the one one week to the next and we took the last week off so it's even harder to kind of get back into the game yeah right yeah, yeah. get back so, in the groove I mean, yeah it happened to me too and i god i think i took monumentality as well yeah i don't even know if there's a way to check at this point but you yeah, took you took the one last time that boosted your science for all of your uh, commercial hubs and stuff because i your science score has just come back to earth <laughs> yeah it, it was, was crazy it last was, era Oh my God, it was so sexy. I mean, like, I'm like, um, yes, please. I'll build a commercial hub here. Oh, Jesus. And, and I just way, realized you're already in the second tier of the industrial era. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I haven't even looked at everybody else. Is... We're, 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 two we're two ranks behind you, basically. Holy hell. You see my you're point? right. You blasted ahead last era, so. Oh my God. Yeah, it's pretty I rough. I didn't even. What about culture? Culture is much more okay. competitive. We're all. <laughs> Poor, poor vices is <laughs> like in the medieval era and yeah. you and i and 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 uh kitten are up here so yeah okay huh that that's kind of funny yep all right man listen let's hang it up i gotta get to sleep <clears throat> absolutely dude thank you uh for being here good night of course and uh, have a good one i will catch you we'll later see you next week all right man all right ladies and gentlemen time to hang it up call it a night i just need to get that thing working there we go okay um night owl if you follow jingles and you follow this channel stay tuned because i think if i've interpreted his comments today correctly tomorrow you'll see somebody you recognize on his channel and it is in fact a game of throws game that i sent him so let's fingers crossed i believe that is what i understand to be happening um i sent it to him and told him my chat said you needed to see this for game book and and it needed to be part of game of throws so we will see what happens tomorrow. But anyway. Um, oh, and of course, the YouTube chat is crapped on me. Oh, actually, so. All right, guys, listen, this has been fun. Thank you for hanging out. Um, regular stream schedule this week means I'm not back until Thursday for boats. The usual boat stream on Thursday. So I um, hope to see you then. Let uh, let me find, see, who, who can, we, can we raid out to over here? Let's have a peek. If you are on YouTube, I will be wrapping up shortly. If you are on the Twitches... We'll be passing you along to someone else, and I have to figure out who. Who indeed, ladies and gentlemen? Who indeed? Um, hmm. 
I don't see anybody streaming Civ that I really recognize. In fact, I don't see anybody streaming Striv at all. Uh, streaming Civ at all. Is there anybody out there? Is it just me and Zath right now? Zath? Yeah, there's me. Okay, there are some people out there. Um, but I think what I'm going to do... I'm looking at my kind of list over here. Hold on. I see aerospace. I see bonds. You know, I, would, I, would kind of, I have rated arrow in the last few weeks, but I might still do it again. Who else is on this list? There's Kriegor. Good to know. He's still around. I haven't seen, seen talked to him in a while. He's good people. Kriegor is good people. Hmm. Hmm. I don't, legit don't know what to do. You guys have any suggestions? If you're in Twitch chat and you have a raid idea, I want to hear it. If you have a raid suggestion, I would love to hear it. If you don't, I will pick something. But if you do, bring it on. I'm not seeing anything. Chat is quiet. Y'all are super quiet tonight. Um, let me look at boats again. Do I recognize anybody over here? You know, I think I'm just gonna send you on to Arrow. I think I'm just gonna raid. I'm just gonna raid Arrow. I'm just gonna raid Arrow. I like Arrow. Arrow's good people. If you enjoy boats and you enjoy planes or space, you should absolutely check out Aerospace. Make sure you throw him a follow. Reggie, good night. Thanks for being here. And I will definitely check out. I'll, I'll, I'll try and learn something about Millennia, okay? Did I get that working? There we go. All right, guys. Raid for Arrow is up. Give him a hashtag Clevergirl for me. Hang out with him. Wish him all the best of luck in boats. I will see you guys on Thursday night. Y'all take care. Peace until then.